Welcome back to Life With Us TV. It's your girl, Lynette. And it's your boy, Stanley. All right, how are y'all doing on this fine Thursday yeah, evening? Man. Hope What's that up, everybody's fam? week has been amazing. Yeah, man. Yeah. So before we even get started, I need y'all to drop down in the chat. When is your next cruise? Yeah, man. When you going on your next cruise? Our next cruise is... Uh, Less than 30 days? Yep, in May. So we're kind of uh, getting hype. Yes, indeed. We're because gonna... y'all know that we kind of took a hiatus. Like after we came from the top 100 um, this year, did we do something after the top 100? Yes, yeah, we, we did. did. Icon. Icon. Yeah. <laughs> and we, after we how did... could we forget the icon? icon yeah, man. <laughs> For real. I mean, shoot, you know that hole that it put in my pocket. <laughs> I definitely still feel it. <sighs> so after we did Icon, we just were like, we're not going anywhere into our group trip in May, right. and that is coming up in less than 30 days. Shameless plug. I Listen, listen at me carefully. I want everybody to make sure that they are on our email notification list. My husband is about to drop that into the chat because what's going to happen is starting in a couple of days, we're dropping all of our 2025 group trips we may even give you some nuggets on some of our personal trips. Indeed. And we're going to call those like sail with us or come with us or whatever. It's not going to be an official group because who has time to plan all that? Not me. Right. Um, but I was hoping to have at least the resort trip ready for you all tonight. But they made a mistake on my link. So I can't release the link until they correct their mistake. But contracts are signed. Yeah, man. Prices are locked down. Swim up suites. Y'all heard what I said. <laughs> Swim up suites are on lock. Like, it's about to be a good guy doing time. Yeah, man. And we're going to need y'all to learn about it. Um, What else do we have for him? Well, I see you guys are in the chat and speaking to us. So what up, go y'all? Uh, what's going on, fam? What's going on, uh, Lido Life? Adina. Adina, what's EJ. up, EJ? What's Tanisha. going on, Tanisha, Angela, Stephanie? What's Steven. up, Stephen? Stephen, I'm sorry about that. Antoine, hey, Miss Charvet. What's going on, <laughs> um, Addy? Uh, so Antoine, Antoine said, "Bro, Stan, what was that drink? I have to get again." Oh, Tokyo Tea, man. Oh man, Tokyo Tea. Y'all gotta stop listening to him. Stop <laughs> listening to him. <laughs> Still see y'all still speaking. And I did what's drop going on, Deshaun. I did drop the link. So when you go over to the group page, what's going to happen is it's going to follow out the there's a pop up's gonna come so you'll be able to add your email in there yeah. to be notified about the upcoming group trips. I still see y'all. What's going on, what's Marcus? Going on? And Didi, what's going on, family? I see you, G. What's going on? G Fox what, in the building. What's up, fam? So we just came right on in and didn't even intro the, no, the Q&A. So, yeah, nope. so the night is the first time <laughs> Cruz was live Q&A. So this is a, your opportunity to hey, be Linda, able to ask the AKA queen um, your most pressing questions before your cruise. And she will answer them as best as she possibly can. Mm -hmm. The only rule we ask you is you put a question in the chat, put either a Q or the word question before. So we can identify so it. So we can know that it is you, yeah. whether it's you have a question. I see some of y'all say your cruise is about to be lit 23 days to go, Jerome. Ooh, yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, um, yeah, I'm ready. Like the, the swag is starting to come in for the stuff that I'm giving away. Yeah, man. Like I'm getting all hype about it. Like I'm tired as hell. <laughs> Don't get it twisted. This week has been a cluster buck <laughs> in a good way. When I say cluster bucks, I'm not saying things are wrong. I'm just saying a girl is booked and busy. <laughs> and when I say busy, I mean busy. So, What's yeah. up, fam? I still see y'all still in the chat speaking there. Uh, I see uh, Sh uh, Shamika said, I just came off the magic for Easter. Okay. And I definitely grabbed me a couple of those Tokyo teas. You fell for it? <laughs> I said, I couldn't see straight at the two of them. I told nope. you. I told you. I got to say, one, get you a little frisky. <laughs> two, show sure enough going to have you on somebody's balcony. Indeed. Just, just hope it's the right one. All right. All right, so what y'all got for me? Uh, so I'm look, looking... I'm going to need y'all to hype me up tonight because I'm tired. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, so looking for some questions. Say, what's up, Missy? Say, I finally called a live. So glad you was able to catch a live. Thank you. I saw earlier before you scrolled up that someone asked where we're going to be on the dream. No, we're not going to be on the dream. And in actuality, we only have one carnival booked. What's no, up, Kelly, a.k.a. Linda? No, that's a lie. 
So we will tell y'all this because it kind of was a surprise to us as well. Y'all know how y'all always ask us, what's your, what, 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 what do you think about the Carnival Horizon? What do you think about the Carnival Horizon? Well, guess who's booked on the Carnival Horizon? Do, do, us. Do, do. And guess who out here being grown in these streets? Do you want to know how, how long of a sailing we're going to be on? Yeah. And y'all know how we was about the seven day. We're pushing it. Oh, we're pushing it. It's an eight day. It's an eight day. But I wanted to get the Southern Caribbean out of my system. Uh-huh. And what better way to get that out of my system but to do it on the ship that we got canceled on, the ship that everybody prefers over the Mardi Gras, the Jubilee, and the celebration. So I was like, let's do a hit, two hit a quitter. Yeah. And we're going to do a side by side. So once we get off of one trip, we're just going to switch and jump on that and one. jump on that one. Cause we're going to make that high flight. Claude said, yes. Count. Right. <laughs> listen, we pay we, Listen, we are sailing in August and the, the flight pricing is pricing. Yeah. So I was like, you know, instead of doubling back, let's just go ahead and make it count. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I see a question in the chat. What's going on, Nick? Say that Nick Knack 86. Let's see. Let me get over here. So all got? right, said so question. Hi, we're going on our first cruise in August for six days on Scarlet Lady. What clothes should I pack? August is going to be hot as heck, yo. So comfortable clothes. Like if you a sundress of uh, sundress girly, pack those. Rumpers do very, very well, but you're going on Virgin. Everything is like super chill. So don't overthink it. Just make sure that you're comfortable, but also pack those things that you can may layer on at night. Like maybe if you want to do the legging thing or, you know, a hoodie or windbreaker jacket, something like that, because at night it does get pretty cool, especially if you're like out on the deck areas or even if you like walking the track or whatever, that wind be whipping. Yeah, it do. But in August, it's going to be hot. Antoine says, statement, family from experience, please pay attention to what they are putting out and don't end up like me and missing out on their group <laughs> events. <laughs> Listen, I, look, we try to be as humble as we try to be when we are announcing these groups because I don't want people to think that we're embellishing about how quickly they do book up. But they do. and But they do. And mm -hmm. I actually push my own limit with the one that we have coming up in July. Because I usually cap my groups at 100 people because I love the intimacy that we create with everybody on board and being able to rub shoulders and actually talk to people. Because I know that a lot of y'all come to come and interact with us and, right. you know, have some banter with us. And I definitely want to have that afforded to you all. And having a group that's too big, I feel like sometimes it might just get out of control and get lost in the sauce. But I will say. Or, or maybe we might have to get out of our own way. I did get out of my own way this but time. We and, did let more people on. And yeah. um, we capped it off at like 140. It's about 140. So somewhere around that. So yeah. we have 140 <laughs> coming um on the one in July. But like I said, like he said, we usually cap it. And they usually cap pretty quickly. So what we say is if, if you see it, I ain't trying to tell you what to do with your money, but I am trying to tell you that it probably will book up fast. And I'm humbled by even being able to say that, that you would spend your money with us. You would travel with us and yes. trust us to give you a good God on time because it's what we do. Right. <laughs> What's up, Lido Life? Thank you so much for the $1.99 super sticker. We greatly appreciate it. And what's up, Jules? Thank you so much for the five dollars super mm -hmm. check. Say, mm -hmm. gang, what's up, fam? What's going on, fam? We greatly Absolutely. appreciate it. Love it. All right, so let's see if we can find some more questions. And also, before we even go further, mm -hmm. shout out to all the members of our channel. Like for real, y'all yes. be holding it down. Yeah, y'all do. And my apologies because I have two membership vlogs <laughs> that I am editing. <laughs> <laughs> to put out to y'all, but what I tell you, <laughs> and then in my mind, I was gonna have um the opportunity to edit last week while we were on vacation, 
we were on vacation last week, y'all. Yeah. But we took our moms on vacation. So yeah, we took them to a resort. So we took them to a resort. They had a good time. They wore us out. They back in their prospective places. And I thought I would could edit like at night. Because in my mind, like you should go to bed early. But they didn't. Right. <laughs> so I didn't get to edit. What's up, Crystal? Crystal said, hey, family and um, VA in the house. What up? Uh, quick, cru uh, quick cruise next week, April the 25th. Compilation, okay. my first one on an older ship. Yes, okay. fingers crossed. <laughs> but at least you know. Like, yeah. you don't go into it, you know, looking at other people's vlogs and seeing, like, the bells and whistles. And then you get on that one, and it'd be like the um, sound bite. Womp, womp, womp. Yeah. <laughs> you already know. All right. What's up, Christy? Christy said, hey, question, Christy. what is the Tokyo tea? The best a mistake. Way, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the best way we describe it is it's basically a Long Island with, with blue liqueur. That's basically what it is. Yeah. 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 And, and anytime they put blue caracal in anything, mm -hmm. it's going to buck you up like two times as yeah, much. Yeah, it's going to take you to a whole nother level. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see. Uh so What's going, up, Arlene? What's going on, James? They're going on Harmony of the Seas. That's what I'm talking about. All Arlene right. said, hey, how are y'all doing? We We're good? Doing wonderful. So y'all really helped me out on a lot for our first crew. For That's First time cruise, for. 429. That's what's up. That's what so we So glad we was for. able to help. That's why we out here. Hey, Ryan. Look, Ryan, get the ship ready for us. Like, make yeah, sure everything is right because we coming through. Coming through with me. And we coming through hot. What's up, Scurry? Say, you guys are the reason me and my wife are going Aww. on our first cruise. Glad we was able to inspire and motivate you guys. That's yeah. what's up. I see y'all. Uh, Katie Pop says strong uh, island iced tea. Yes. <laughs> That's exactly what Literally. it is. Literally. It's so, like somebody were li was like, you know what? This is a strong enough. Let's go ahead and hit it up a few notches. Why? Why? Hey, Derek. Um, hey, Halima. You can, um, um, mainly you can find the Tokyo Tea in the um, casino bar. Mm -hmm. But sometimes you can go to the other bars and still ask for it. And sometimes they can do it for you. Yeah. But I, to be honest with you, I think they do it better and stronger in the casino. Oh, absolutely. Because, because, they, because you oh. ain't there, so they want you to spend your money. Yeah. <laughs> absolutely. Yeah. All right, let's see. All right, you're scrolling up. Do, 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 do. What's up, fam? See some of y'all still in the chat. Jubilee, still speaking. We got this. magics. All um, right, here we go. Question, what is the good water from the sushi restaurant that they always be talking about? I really don't like the Dollar Tree water they sell us on Carnival. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so let me give you a little tip, right? So... If you're just like sailing and you don't have like a drink package, they may look at you crazy if you just go and ask to be charged for this water. But if you have like the drink package and you go to the sushi bar, they will, instead of giving you that Dollar Tree crap water, they will give you the, what is it? It's in the glass. Shh. Hold on. So you can't think of name. <laughs> um, But it's the good water. Yeah. And... I was getting it by the leaders and uh, and here's the thing. I should search my pictures because I know I have a picture of it because I made sure that um so you can remember it. So I can remember it. Um it's not um the Pellegrino because no, I can't remember what it is, but it's it's good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. San Pellegrino. But if you go to our... Is it San Pellegrino? Is it? So if we go... It might be. But if you go to our Carnival Magic... Oh, Perry. Per no, I don't think it's Perry. Yeah, shoot. I was going to cuss. Somebody said Panna? Mm -mm. Let's see. Hold on. Here's the fact that I just put water into my phone and my um my album for my photos and everything we've done in the last two years could contains water. <laughs> so yeah, that didn't help. <laughs> um, but yeah, go yeah. to the sushi bar and ask them for a bottle of water. You'll get the good stuff. So Jasmine said aqua panel. That's a, that sounds that kind of mm -mm, uh, it's not that because that's the one with like the red and the label. Like this is oh, okay. um clear and green. 
All right, let's see. We got a question. What's going on? Phil Love 39 said, question, have y'all cruised the Carnival ship Sunrise? Several times. Yes, we have. We've several been several times. times. And every time we've been on it, we've highly enjoyed it. Listen, enjoyed it so much that I got a battle wound Yeah, that I had to come <laughs> back and have surgery <sighs> because I was out in Jamaica cutting the food. Yeah. It really wasn't cutting the food. I, I failed. It was on Dunn's River. It was on Dunn's River, Phil. Yeah. So if you're doing Dunn's River, be careful. Yeah. But it was fun. It was an accomplishment. Won't ever do it again. All right. What's going on, Ryan? Thank you so much Thank for you, the uh, four ninety nine dollars Super Chat. We greatly, greatly appreciate it. What's going on, EJ? EJ. 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 Didn't you just share with me that you're paying for a trip? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, man, for the forty nine ninety nine uh super chat. So as always, thank y'all for do all that you do. Y'all help me out tremendously, and I am forever grateful. Oh, we are so we glad are grateful to help, for y'all. We, yeah, we like, are so y'all don't grateful. even know. Yeah, so uh, and um, shameless plug. I, I think I saw somebody. I think it was um, I saw somebody was saying they can't wait for class. Was it uh, oh. I saw your message, but it, it went by so fast. But yeah, we have um for those of you who don't know, we we finally launched Lynette's travel agent class, mm -hmm. which go along with my YouTube class. So basically, in Lynette's class, if you want to take that, if you're a travel agent, if you are a new travel agent new. that's considering becoming a travel agent, or you have became a travel agent and now you're stuck on how do I serve clients? How do I get clients? And when I do get clients, how I take care of them. That class teaches you that. That's me. My class actually teaches you how to use YouTube as a marketing tool to reach your customers. So if you're interested in that and them two classes, the link is down in the description. And while we own that, we have finally, finally launched our Life With Us TV shirts. I know. Uh, um, nice who, like this. Who, keep on, who kept on getting on us? Uh, a lot of Tavon. people. Tavon. I'm not sure Tavon. So we finally got our swag out there. So the link is in the description. It's the shirts we got on. Uh, so feel free. If you want one, you can definitely get one. Um, um, that's it. So I'm back to the chat. Yeah. We're, we're very much one of those people that are very like, it has to be on point. Yeah. So before we launched them out, we Got them, washed them over and over and yeah. over. Because we want to make sure that once y'all yeah. get them, they ain't cracking up, shrinking, right. fading. And, and if y'all do get them and do that, you let us know so we can, we can fix all that. So yeah, It we ain't going to happen because we yeah. don't trust it out. <laughs> What's going on, Scott? <laughs> thank you, Scott. For, thank you for the uh, 199 Super Chat. Uh, super Sticker. Sorry about that. What's going on, Kim? Thank you for the 499. Say, Take hey, care. hey, Jubilee in 15 days. Tokyo tea in each hand. <laughs> so you're going to be double fisting it. That's what I'm talking about. Please don't. <laughs> don't. <laughs> oh, no. <sighs> Let's see. Where we at? Let's see. Back to the chat. Let's see. What's going on, Sherry? I see ya. You say we're going to love an eight day? Pray for us. Yeah, we're going to. Yeah. Because the way I'm set up, like, I need a change in scenery every so often. And I don't know. But I, I, I'm excited about the itinerary. Like, I really am excited. What's up, Yolanda? Yolanda said, uh, question, have you ever booked a mobility scooter for a client? Absolutely. So my mom, partially paralyzed, I do it over and over again. So get with um, Scoot Around. Depending on your port, most of them have a station right there at the port. It's an easy process. Go online, book it, and either they'll bring it to your cabin or they'll meet you, or you can meet them on the curb or at their little um tent. Get it? Easy breezy. Yep. Yep. My aunt, she actually uses one as well. I don't book hers for her, yeah, but she, she comes with us and she, she has one. She gets it. What's up, Annie? Annie said, not a first timer, but love the tips and the uplifting show. Thank you. Thank <laughs> we you. will be on a cruise May the 25th, five days on the freedom after the fire <laughs> after the fire. Yeah. <laughs> Looking forward look, look, to look. enjoy cruising. Fire number two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Lord, what's going on, Claude? Say so you on so you on the horizon um in September. That's what's up. 
huh? Hold on, wait a minute. No, you're gonna miss us because those girls say you might be on it with us, right? So, uh, what's up, Happy 1982? That Tokyo tea got to be the last drink of the night or something. I, <laughs> I've never had one, but I'm making that my last drink of the smart. night at least the first time. <laughs> smart, the smartest thing I've heard in this chat tonight. No, nah, make, <laughs> make it your first one, make it your first one. So let me tell you something about my husband on vacation. I am the rational one. He's the what? might as well, might as well. You what you here for? You on vacation? You That's what right. You That's what you here for. And then when the pimp comes out and the voice really changed, <laughs> you really know you in danger. Like soon as that, that man, come on, man, man, that's what you here for. <laughs> It's over at that point. Like he hey. can talk you into anything at that point. Hey, and y'all hey. fall for it every time. I know this is an old school saying, but don't hate the player. Hate the game. Oh, shoot. It's I, a- look, I wrote the player handbook. I'm just allowing you to use it. Thank you, TG Customs. said ordered my t shirt. So excited. Thank oh. you so much. So I think you probably you would be the first order unless we unless you know somebody did for you, but greatly, greatly appreciate it. I see it. Yep, there you go. Yep. <laughs> Thank you so much, fam. Thank greatly you. appreciate it. Greatly appreciate it. We hope you would enjoy your share. Look, I ain't got no church tamarine. I will hit you with one. <laughs> Dealing with a shop. <laughs> oh Lord, have mercy. Uh, what's up, Whitney? Whitney has a question. Say, how can I make reservations for, for free restaurants on Carnival Mardi Gras in advance to Bang? And I can never say that right. You can't. Yeah, so I guess you just say it. <laughs> yeah, you, no, I didn't talk about you. I was talking about, no, you can't do oh. um, the reservations in advance on Carnival for the free rest, um, for the free restaurants. So basically, if you have any time down in, just check in in your app and it's really never an issue, to be honest with you. So don't think that, oh, you may not be able to get in. Usually it's not an issue at all. But if you have set time dining, they request for you to wait until 745. <laughs> then that button comes alive where you're able to select to go to those other restaurants rather than going to your designated um, restaurant. Right. All right. Let's see what we got. I see the next question is coming in from Chanel. What's going on, Chanel? It's a question. How do they handle the drink age and gambling age? Does it depend on the port? I thought I read something that Carnival changed something. I honestly don't know. And I've always kind of wondered that, too, because if you kind of look Look old enough, right? who's really checking you? Right. I mean, I know when they scan your card. You know what? No, it's the card. It's the card. So it has to be something that prompts in the um system when they scan the card. It has to be. All right. Let's see. Uh, what's up, Crystal? Say, hey, family. Oh, I right dared that one. Yeah, um, we got that one earlier, right? Yeah, you did. Yeah. What's going on, Ryan? What's up, fam? Let's see, here we go. Crystal said Horizon's our favorite ship. It's everybody's favorite ship. Yeah. Listen, I was just talking about Cookie today. And I was like, I ain't trying to be funny. I'm, and y'all know I love me some carnival. But what is going on over there at carnival? Like all of their crews, their good cruise directors are literally right. jumping ship. We were talking about Ryan Rose. Like Ryan Rose didn't jump ship. They, they booted him. Right. But I'm like, you can start to see that the vibe ain't what it used to be. Get your cruise directors back. Like, right. Or do something. <laughs> What's going on, Fox Den? So, question is, so how can I join you on a cruise? I am I'm missing the fan. I know, G. It's coming real difficult. I, I mean, I miss you with Ashley, man. Man, we got to bring the band back together. Hey, look, like we said at the beginning, the, the next trip is coming out soon once they get, mm-hmm. get this paperwork straight. Well, not, not paperwork, but that. It's the, the link. Way, it's the link straight for us. We're going to be... Putting that uh did you tell did you tell them what it was? Mm-mm. Okay, maybe. I mean I can. Uh well, let's answer a few more questions, then we <laughs> then we then we'll do that. You see what he did to y'all? He, <laughs> he brought you all the way up to the climax and said, took it away, made it build up again. Scott says, Where is the best places to eat in Gaveston? Um, I have no we're idea. not sure, but if anybody who have crews out of Gaveston. Mm-hmm. Please put that down in the chat and we can let Scott know where some good places to get some good. I can say, but I heard Texas is the place to get great food. Got eight food. That's good. I mean, after you go through them freaking airports, they better feed you good. All right. (laughs) (laughs) 
All right, so where are we at? Let's so see. I'm flying into Fort Lauderdale a day before. Any suggestions on getting a getting to Miami for the hotel? So you need advice on get any suggestions on getting to Miami? Um, easy. Uber, Lyft. I prefer Lyft to be honest with you. You get better drivers, better quality cars, pay more. So you know, but you can also do the Brightline train. You can also mm -hmm. do the um train that runs within the airport. I can't remember the name of a tri rail. You can do tri rail and do it that way. And then the Uber, of course, would be cheaper from that station to whatever hotel that you're in. Or you can simply just stay in a hotel in Fort Lauderdale and then commute the next morning. That's not a bad drive. See somebody said where is Cookie? Uh, he went work he um uh, well last time was a substitute teacher. Cookie, Cookie is everywhere. <laughs> Last, yeah, he was doing some substitute <clears throat> teaching. Um, I seen him somewhere else, so I I think he's just out here being free, living his good his best life. I'm not mad at him. Yeah. He looks happy. He looks healthy. And that's what it's all about. Yeah, like sometimes you just got to step away from the noise to find your own peace, regardless of what everybody else wants you to to be or do and we are selfish because we, i don't mean to cut you off yes, but, you but i see my see my angel numbers up there it's 333 of you guys yeah, in the too. house so if you're getting any value out this live do not forget to smash that like button when you come in the door listen you but cut, i didn't mean to cut you, you off, cut off the angel i didn't mean to, to talk about angel numbers yes <laughs> sorry about that no you're not <laughs> <laughs> oh so right, let's get back in here. So let's see. Uh, let's see. Kimberly um, has a question. Mm -hmm. What's up, Kimberly? She's a question. I have Apple Music and I want to play it in my cabin. So if I get the internet package, will, will that work? On the premium. Yeah, because you're streaming now. Because you're streaming. Yeah. So if you don't want to pay for the premium, then download you download a playlist. Music. That's yeah. what I do. Like I have a whole playlist in my... I do it on YouTube music um, because that's my place of choice. And I just be vibing out like I know what the next song going to be, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. What's going on? Manny says, question, how is the steakhouse on the Carnival Magic? OK, so I'm going to answer this, give <sighs> you my real honest <laughs> feedback based on what happened to us or our experience. But I'm also going to play devil's advocate. It won't that good. It was okay. Um, they, none of them can do sides. I don't care what specialty restaurant you go on, on Carnival, Royal Caribbean, the sides are trash. All of them. I don't understand. Yeah. It's almost like they went to school and they said, focus on the meat. <laughs> and everything else is just like, why yeah. is the macaroni and cheese like this? Why is the broccoli like rubbery like what is going on but i will say just because our experience wasn't like top tier That's there's other say. people's that has been very top tier because you got to realize that you can we can go to the same place at different times and our experiences are totally different right by the time you get there the same the chefs that were there cooking for us they're no not more. even there no more right so go into it <laughs> have your own experience with it if you like it right. do it again if you don't like it you can at least catch the vibe of what the potential is right. and you may not ever want to do it again like for us we don't have to do it but because we sail so often we still will do it every now and then right. just because it breaks up the main dining room or you know the burgers and stuff so yeah all right uh oops let me get it back uh What's going on, Almighty Streams? Thank you so much for the nine ninety nine super chat. Thank so y'all got me ready, ready. Come on now. First cruise on Folk twenty two. Kind of a breeze. Kind of a breeze. That's what's up. So glad we was able to help. Thank you so much. Yeah, I sell a buttload of breeze dream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Said my Texas people don't be playing. No, they don't. What's going on, Victor? Thank you so much for the four ninety nine super chat. Said been following your YouTube since 123. Okay. And thank you for your tips on cruises. Our first cruise is 523. And awesome. we are we have an um an exclusive resort in Cancun for August. Come on now. Uh, uh, hey, go big or go home. Hey. That's what that's what's and it up. don't look like y'all going home. <laughs> <laughs> Love it for you. What's up, what's up, Carissa? Thank you so much hey, for the 499 super chat. Say hello. 
I'm going on my first solo cruise in May. Excited to book another, but it's so exp expensive to book just one. It yeah. is. And any tips to get deals as a solo sailor? Book as early as possible. Yeah, really and saying. of course, if you're not specific about your room, like mm -hmm. a lot of solos go with the interior cabins, you can do that. But for the most part, if you're not booking a cruise line that actually has solo cabins, it is what it is. Right. It sucks. <clears throat> I mean, but it's kind of the same with, you know, well, it ain't kind of the same. It's the same with hotel rooms. You book the room and not for how many people is really going to be in it. Right. All right, what's going on, Kevin? Hey, Kevin. Thank you so Thank much you. for the five dollar super chat. Say, hey, cousins, I enjoy your videos, especially when I'm driving this eighteen wheeler. That's what I'm talking about. We help have me, a lot of through. truckers. We have yeah, a lot of a truckers lot. Yeah. that tell us that they legit watch, watch listen to us while right. they're on the road. Right. So, we appreciate y'all. Hey, look, I want to see if anybody else in the chat. So if you uh trucker in the and chat, not driving right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't type while you're driving. But if you yeah, if you in a stationary place, go and put that, put that down in the chat so we can see who you is. <laughs> <laughs> and he says, see who you is. See who you is. But appreciate not it, Kevin, are. man. Appreciate the support and glad we able to thank help you, you out, Sasha. man. What's going on? Uh, thank you for the two dollar super chat as well. December or January for Caribbean cruise. It's about the same. It's about the same, but yeah. I will say if you want to get a better price, yeah, January. January. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see what we got. What's what's up, Lisa? Hey, thank Lisa. you, thank you so much for the nine ninety nine super chat. Greatly appreciate it. Said so I attended my first quest on the magic. In March, thanks to both of you for telling me to attend. <laughs> you saw it stuff was that so you can't speak much of. fun, and also have my first Tokyo tea. Thank you. We're <laughs> bad influence on your life. Bad influences on your life. Ooh, all right, I see we got. I see somebody else putting the chat. Just ordered my shirt. We in West. Thank you so much. Greatly appreciate it. Is we the only one? I don't want to make sure I don't want to miss nobody else. Oh, I see like four, five. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, y'all. Oh, y'all in here. Oh, y'all ordering. Thank y'all. I appreciate it. I don't want to be putting you like y'all government out here. Y'all yeah, ain't so, tell us to, but but thank you. Thank you so oh, much. We appreciate thank you. that. Thank you so much. Greatly, uh, greatly appreciate it. Oh, that's right. I forgot. Uh Tavon, you a trucker too. Say, did I know that? I think he did tell us. I think. I don't know if I knew that, Tavon. Hmm. I see Lawrence say I'm a trucker. Jerome, Jerome is a driver. Okay. Oh, shucks. Come on now, driver. Wait, wait. Yes, sir. Come on through. Wait, 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 wait. Let me see. Uh, all right. Let me see. I don't see nobody else. I there. appreciate y'all. James man. said he's a trucker. Okay. Come okay. On. What? Truckers come through. Come on now. <laughs> y'all make talking. the world go round. Yes, indeed. Man, we appreciate y'all. Y'all be safe on that road. All right. Let's see. And y'all behave on the road too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Kimberly? Thank you so much for the uh, four ninety nine super chat. We appreciate greatly, you. greatly appreciate it. All right. Let's what go. else we got going on? Slide on the back on. Over. Hey, Damien and Quinny. What's up? What's up, family? What's, what's, go, what's going on, Joe? I saw what you typed, baby. <laughs> <laughs> That conversation has rang in my head all day today, and I just chuckle <laughs> every Crazy. time. Hey, Joe, what's going on? What's going on, Nicholas? And hey, fam, y'all were such help before I went on my first cruise. Already booked my second and third. That's what I'm talking oh, about. Oh, so you just showing off with right? It. Like, hey, hey you go I'm not big, mad. Go big or go home. I'm not mad. Go I'm big. gonna need these cruise lines to run me some um some affiliate money. <laughs> I'm gonna like run me my coin. But you know what? What is crazy? Like. Me and my um travel agent friend was talking, and she was like, I know Carnival be hooking you up. I said, Carnival don't give me skit. <laughs> like, <laughs> literally, Carnival, as much business as I give them, Carnival does not give us nothing. No. I've earned one comp cruise, and that was not through Carnival. That was, that was, that host was my agent. host agency. That was host agency. Giving me a yeah. comp cruise. Otherwise, we pay for all our skit with Carnival. Yep. And we're absolutely no, no. Is, mad is that, about it. Is that the question you're talking about from Damien? What's your thoughts on Royal Caribbean's casino program? Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> I'm not answering that. The, the answer to the question is, Damien, make sure <laughs> shut up, Stella. <laughs> that you follow the rules. That's all. Follow the rules. Read the follow, fine print. Read the fine print. <laughs> Ooh, make no. sure that before you sell your chips, <laughs> you know that you can't sell your chips. So Shamika said, I'm not a driver, but I got my CDLs. That, awesome. Hey, that's still awesome, though. That is awesome. That is awesome. So that job is not for the week. No. Mm -mm. All right. Let's see. We used to be infatuated with <laughs> um, trucks when we were um, small. And we used to sit on the hill and make them blow the horn. Yep, that joint, that joint was dope. I'm, I'm showing my age. What's up? What's up, Jessica? Say, hey, you finally called alive. I and love y'all. Thank you so much uh, for making these videos to help people who don't know jack about cruising. Listen, <laughs> hope hoping to love cruising. Hope so too. Oh, you do too. It's and and I will be honest, it's not for everybody. And it actually took us a while to settle into knowing our cruising's place in our cruise arsenal. Right. I mean, in our travel arsenal. It took us a while. And it took us a while to figure out which cruise line was our cruise line. Because Carnival, although we love them, our cruise line is Virgin. Yeah. Like, that love is them. the cruise line that if you gave me a stack of money right now and just say book something, I'm going to book Virgin. So, yeah, you definitely have to figure out what your what your cruise vibe is and gravitate to it. Yeah. And then you can, you can move around a little bit, but like I turn a song say, but the name stays home. Name stays home. <laughs> What's going on, Taz? Taz said first, uh, first cruise, uh, uh, going in July the 16th on the Forenza on the 19th of August. What is a must pack and anything I should know about? Well, first, uh, you definitely want to make sure you bring your tumbler. Yes, a make lanyard, a lanyard, and a reusable straw. The reason why, because mm -hmm. Connor will give you those candy straws, and they suck, and they suck. In our opinion, but I mean, but you might, you might, you might love them. No, um, nobody loves but them. But it's just, a, it's just a means <laughs> to a drink. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um. Other than that, um, if you're a, a person that gets into water, definitely get some kind of sw um waterproof. Phone case, fanny pack, all of that. And I will say, like, we give a lot of tips about stuff not to forget, but also we want to drive home the fact of don't stress yourself out trying to not forget things. Zaya trying to make us cuss. What? <laughs> <laughs> don't stress yourself out trying not to forget things because you're going to learn. Like, as much as you <clears throat> absorb, there's still going to be things that you're going to learn on the job. You know what I'm saying? Right. And then there's going to be things that we may recommend you pack and you have no need for them. Like we're getting ready to do a updated packing video or things that we take on a cruise because it has changed. Yeah. Like the things that we used to pack, we yeah. don't even pack yeah. them no more. Like we've gotten so much more simpler in how we, you know, the approach that we take. What else you got? Yeah, I was going to say also, Taz, we, on our website, we do have a cruise essential store. And so do. we do recommend that you go and check out that because we have a lot of things that we do recommend on there. Um, essentials that we feel like that you should take to make your cruise that much more better. Yep. So check that out. Um, our website is linked in the description. As well. we absolutely but if you want to type it in, in, in the, on the uh, web browser, it's uh, cofundtravel.com. Mm-hmm. And that's C O D E F U N <clears throat> travel. What's up, Imani? He said, hey. How do we book the cruise in July? It's, it's sold, sold out. out. It's sold out. Yeah, it's sold out. My mind is made. What's up? up? What's up? Nicholas said, Is there anything worth going to in Montego Bay and Cayman Islands? Montego Bay. I remember that. Try to do one of the all-inclusive resorts. Like it is not through the cruise line. No. <laughs> so, but if you're first time, I don't <clears throat> recommend you doing that. Um, but if you more experienced, you can do one of those. They are actually fun. Cayman Islands, we walked around. And I don't have to do it again, honestly. I don't have to do that island again. Beautiful. Yeah, it's nice. But I don't have to do it again. So just maybe just do if you find an excursion. 
do that. I know that the um, stingrays are very popular there. I want to do it. He definitely does not want to do it with me, and he nah. won't let me do it by myself. I mean, I, I never said you couldn't do it by yourself. You don't want to do it with me, well, so I'll, I'm going to pay. I'll, I'll go over there. I'll... See, see, I saw what they did to Steve Irwin. <laughs> <laughs> But you let me in the water with a with a dolphin. Hey, dolphins ain't never kill nobody that I know of. They grapist. They who? I can't say the word. Oh yeah, yeah. That's a whole yeah. That's a whole nother. <laughs> yeah, that's a whole nother subject right there. Kim says right. go to hell and Grand Cay I mean um Cayman Islands. Yes. Okay. Yes. For a minute, I thought she was <clears throat> telling me to go to hell. I was like, what do I do? <laughs> what do I do? All right. So I think we answered that one. So mm -hmm. like, like again with, Katie Pop. Say where we at? Okay, so I'm I'm back. Zaire through. said he thought the MSC was our favorite cruise line. We're gonna I'm gonna we're gonna sit down and do a review that's not within a live for MSC because we did do uh, one in the live. We yeah. did it in the live, but if people didn't come to that live, they don't know that it's there. <clears throat> well, I even thought about maybe pulling it out the live and posting it too. That works for me too. I don't have yeah, to we'll record. <laughs> that works for me too. What's up, Rosa? Welcome. Say I'm new here. Welcome. Well, welcome. welcome to the family. Welcome to the welcome. family. What you bringing to the cookout? Uh, blessings to you too, Chris. All right. What's up again? And mine said, what cruise would you recommend for a couple celebrating their 40th wedding anniversary? But first of all, I want to say congratulations, congratulations. on, on 40. Wait That's a minute, because you look young as hell. Yeah, you look like you about 30 20. or 40 in that picture right there. 20. Yeah. So you're asking for somebody else or yourself. <laughs> but for a 40th wedding anniversary, if they are more of a mature 40, um, well, that means they're probably in there. They got married at 20. They might hit in the 60s, 60-ish. Royal Caribbean. Royal Caribbean would be good. Um, celebrity mm -hmm. would be very good for them. Um, if they are like, go, 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 kind of. They didn't even do virgin. Like, It's not going to be like the romantic type of celebration. On on Virgin, she but you're gonna have a that's her parents. Okay, because okay. I was like, ain't no freaking way. <laughs> Royal Caribbean. Royal Caribbean or celebration. I mean celebrity. All right, let's see. Say so is a suite worth it over a balcony room if the price is right? Yeah. Um, I love a good suite because one, I like to spread out. Yeah, I like my space, and, and and they give you a tub. Yeah, and we're bathtub people, so we're gonna get in there and clean that bathtub all the way out, and then we gonna we 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 we're bathtub people. The I'm I'm country bred. I got a lot going on. I need to soak it. You know how back in the, like they say, the old people say you gotta <laughs> soak your meat. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see where we at. Where we at? Where we at? I think I, yeah, I got that one. What's going on, Nicole? Thank you so much for the five dollars super chat. Say finally my first live. Tokyo T took me out on the Liberty in March. <laughs> hey, at this point, I blame all of y'all. Like y'all literally keep falling for this. Hey, that 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 at Tokyo this T point, man. That Tokyo T is not to be played with. And I love, but I do love when I can get one that's not super sweet. So usually, yeah, middle, if you're yeah. not. They will make it super, super syrupy, but tell them if you're not a super sweet person, I like tart drinks. Um, tell them to dial that back. But with me, it's like sip, sip, sip. And then Stanley will be like, nah, you might as well get another, get another one. one. And then you taking pictures and don't remember you took pictures with people. Yeah. <laughs> until you reviewed your camel reel the next day. <clears throat> All right, let's see. What's up again, Chanel? Said thank you, Chanel. Thank you so much for the ten dollars super chat. Appreciate all the appreciate gems y'all throwing out. We appreciate y'all. Y'all right, come through every week. Look, yes, we are did. nothing without y'all showing right. up every week, viewing our videos in our sleep. We appreciate it. What's up, Nikki Boo one ninety four? Thank you so much for the one ninety nine super you, chat. Honey. Greatly appreciate that. Thank you, Josh. Oh, uh, what's up, Josh? Uh, thank you for the ten dollars super chat. What's happening, y'all? Hit. Uh, Y'all hitting my first cruise on September the 8th on the Mardi Gras. Okay. Uh, for my third, my 33rd. 30, 30, 30. All right. 
I done watched so many of y'all videos. Y'all damn near <laughs> my new cruise fairies. <laughs> I'm for sure getting Tokyo tea. That's what I'm. That's what's up, Josh. <laughs> Just gonna fall for it, right? <laughs> Just gonna fall for it. Hey, but you, you picked a good one for your um first. Hey, like I like I tell everybody on the trip, you might as well. Didn't I tell you that's you what might, he says? You might as well. Might as well. Might as you well. That's what you here for. You paid your buddy. That's what you here right, for. You, you come a long ways if you know not going to have a good time. <sighs> here for a good time, not for a long time, you know. I... What's up, Melissa? Hey, Question. Melissa. Um, This is my first. Is is fly to the fun worth it for people? Who, faster to the fun. Faster to the fun worth it for people with no passport. Um. And, and getting off the and ship. getting off the ship. ship. Now I will tell you, I usually say that faster to the fun is a money grab, and it is. But if you don't have a passport, this is this is where I'm going to say it is worth it because that um, birth certificate line getting off of a cruise ship is nothing to be played with. That line can be super freaking long. Yeah. So if you haven't um, faster to the fun, you're able to get off early priority disembarkation so you'll be able to get ahead of the crowd so i will say it is worth it in that regard indeed uh what i just see uh hey denise you ready for class i am ready to yeah for sure i am ready I just, uh, wait. yeah we had our coaching um class last night what is that Somebody what's up else? Somebody else. Hold on. What's up, Steven? Said just bought two of y'all shirts. Super appreciate excited. That. Appreciate that. Appreciate that, Steven. Greatly appreciate it. Who is these kids in my yard? They're probably uh um down the street. Get your kid out my yard. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What's up, Jackie? Uh, say hi. I'm a new travel agent, new to the business. Welcome. Okay, welcome. 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 It's, a, it's a great business to be in. It is. It it's is. Great Especially if you love to create memories for people. <clears throat> Get them on the right track. Um, Speaking of, y'all probably going to say, yeah, Mom of the video idea I came up about for travel agents. Um, The name of the idea I told the queen because... Hold on. Can y'all see us? Never mind, never mind. Okay. Cause I was looking at my own phone and I went black. <laughs> um darn. You made me lose my train of thought when you uh when you said that. So I'm a, so I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep on moving and then when it comes back, I will yeah. So so you said it just like went right out of my head. What's up? What's up? Uh Sharice said finally caught you guys live. Thank God. Hello, Thank how are you? And yes. We are good. We, we are, are good. good. We are doing good. We are good and busy and tired, but we are here in good spirits. What's up again, Ryan? Said, what are the best restaurants on the celebration? Let me see. The uh, Tobachi was was. I great. liked Hibachi. Hibachi I'd actually great. liked um, um, Rudy's. I like yeah, Rudy's. Rudy's yeah, Some Rudy's. people say they don't like it, but maybe yeah, we caught Rudy's. them on a good day. Yeah, Rudy's was delicious to me. Yeah, um, but I, I we didn't get to eat at Emeralds. Nah. But I'm going to hit it this time because honestly, Emeralds seems to be everyone's favorite eating spot out of all the restaurants. So we definitely gonna be in there. Right. We definitely um, gonna be in Shebang's there. Shebang's was okay for us. Yeah, it was yeah. certain things. Yeah, it was like you were certain. So things. get the um shout out to Zaire Haka Noodles. Yeah. They are great. Um, I don't know what I had. The shrimp wasn't all that, but it was some kind of um beef. Like uh, it reminded me of like bourbon chicken, but in the beef form. But I can't remember what it was. It was good. Oh, my question came back to video idea. Um, <clears throat> uh, the video idea is to teach you guys how to uh, make money from your traveling. So basically, take your passion for oh. traveling and turn it into money. Turn into passive income. Yeah. Well, something like that. It's yeah. kind of passive. Yeah. It's work, but yeah, it's still work. But yeah. Yeah. Because I was talking, to, I was talking to my barber. Shouts out to Rob if he if he's on here. Cause What's going on, um, Rob? Uh Rob actually takes a lot of his family and friends on vacation. And we know that a lot of y'all do the same thing. You take a lot of your family, friends, you do all this planning, and you could be getting paid for that. So mm -hmm. I told the queen, I was like, maybe we can, you know, I know we got our class and stuff like that, but 
it will be so easy to teach you guys how to yeah. how to turn your travel into money. It's is it's it's simple, but it's work. But if y'all if that's yeah. something you're interested in, just put that in the chat so we'll so yeah. we'll know. We can throw that out there. What's up, Jacita? What's going on, fam fam? Was that you? What my phone? No, it's uh what's up, T Madison said. Do you use a, a Senate plugin in your rooms? If so, what's your favorite scent? Yes, yes we, I do. Yes, we do. Um, I think that's one of those things that I kind of like. I ain't say I made that, but I think I made it popular for people to do. Because even when we we're on cruises, they were like, you do the plug-in too? And I'm like, everybody else don't do this. <laughs> so I like clean scents, like period. So my favorite one is the Snuggle. I love to yeah. smell that cotton, the, the cotton scent. And the... um. That cotton linen or linen something, basically it smells like clean clothes. I love that. I don't really do too much of like the fruity stuff or whatever, but I will tell you this. Then I go opposite. So if you like Bath and Body Works, it's highly toxic. Most of them are. But hmm. that mahogany teak wood. Yeah, man. Yeah, that's that's a good one. That mahogany teak <clears throat> wood smells like an expensive man. Baby, I just went to a place. Yeah, get that. Yeah, get that. Uh, the the link to the class is in the description. All right. Hey, have All right. So I see Lisa said yes. Please, um, do a travel travel video on income. Okay, so for income. Uh, so that's the idea. Okay. So where do you get the ten percent gift cards for cruises for our AARP? AARP. You have to be an AARP member, member and be on their website to be able to purchase those. All right. Let's see. Uh, what's up again? Habit 1982 said, question, if you have unlimited drinks at the casino with your promotion and the, and the drink package, does the drink package count against the 15 drink package beverages? I see what you said. So if you got unlimited drinks in the casino, if you if you take advantage of that, would that take from your 15 drinks from your drink package? So you're trying to buy both? No, you can't buy both because they're gonna be like. No, he, so he's, I think he, he has counting? it. He has it. Oh, okay. He said, he said if 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 you have unlimited drinks at the casino with your promotion, and the drink package does the drink package count against the fifteen drink package? I believe it does. Quote me if I'm wrong, people in the chat, because I don't. I'm not. I ain't never been afforded that, but I think it is still capped at fifteen. <clears throat> it's actually something I probably should have known, but I didn't. What's up, Carl? Hey, I can't know it all now. I know the, I know what I'm supposed to know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, let's see. Look, and I'm humble enough to know when I don't know something, I ain't going to make it up. Yeah. Let's see. What's up, Jackie? So y'all have a lot of knowledge and make it fun to watch. Appreciate that. Appreciate it. We try to. We try to. What's going on, Danny? No, it's not. I don't think it's San Pellegrino. I'm now y'all gonna make sure that y'all are in my Facebook group page, Co Fun Travel for Carnival Cruises, something like that. Yeah, and I'm gonna drop it in there because it's gonna bother me now Until, that I can't yeah. figure it out. And speaking of, since you brought it up before, it just goes Why out does my this head. lady have this kid in my yard? Hey, I'm not worried about that lady right now. I am. See, you made me forget again. Oh, the groups. So, um, if you are not a part of our Carnival Facebook group, make sure that you go in the description and check that out as well. And then also we have a Facebook group for Virgin as well. So check those out in the description. Uh, what's up again? Rosa said, um, why is it when they cancel a port, you get hardly nothing back money wise? I will say this. I think that it's really unfortunate when stuff like that happens, but fortunately, unfortunately, fortunately, um, the biggest thing is to keep you safe. Yeah. And usually when they are canceling a port, one safety two medical emergency happen, they just can't do it. Usually. The only thing that they will do is give you back your port fees and taxes because it's a part of your cruise contract. And you you sign off on that whether you know that or not when you do your cruise check-in. I mean, you do it too when you make your first payment. Basically saying that they are set, the, yeah. the itinerary is set, but it can change. Um, 
sometimes they will give you a good measure of a you know some onboard credit while you're on board. It's right. not required, but it is something that you know the people on board can make a decision to do. I mean, it's just one of those things. And I get it both ways. We have been on board and we've had our itinerary change. And you're looking forward to being in a specific place. I mean, because you book your stuff based on itinerary most of the time. Right. And sometimes it just can't happen. And that's the that's true. That's the unfortunate thing yeah. with taking We've had cruise it travel. Once, what? once or twice. Once or twice. It hasn't yeah. been a lot. Yeah, like once or twice. It barely it barely happens stuff. Yeah. Yeah. I just hate when they when you gotta go to a suck port. <laughs> That part. Yeah. What's up? What's up, close? A question. First cruise in a few weeks. Um, what are the correct documents to get on Long Beach to Aracita? To Asanada. Asanada. I said it wrong. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I ain't even <laughs> had to look at it to tell. <laughs> um, if you have your passport, then your passport. Also travel with your, your state issued ID. I t- I <laughs> Travel with your ID. I don't understand why people fight about not taking an ID. It's an ID. Take yeah. your ID. Um, or if you're traveling with your birth certificate, birth certificate, a valid birth certificate, and your ID. Yep. You, you know, those are the basics. And then also, um, if you want additional information, we recently posted uh, a video to the channel on must-have documents sure did. for your first Carnival Cruise. So you can definitely check that out as well. And then in that video, we have a link to our blog. So it's also in writing. So if you can see it in writing, you can check that out as well. Absolutely. All right. No, it's not Voss Water, Christy. I wish. <laughs> <laughs> what's up? What's up, Sarice? Say, I am a um, dog I'm- drinker, but I really, really want to try this tea. You are a what drinker? That's it. I know that's not what yeah, you mean. Yeah, it's a spell check. <laughs> yeah, it's tea that you guys are speaking of so high. right on here. <laughs> it's Ooh. not Fiji either, Mia. Yeah. It's going to bother me now. And I'm going to find it. But as soon as I get off here, I'm going to like go through yeah, my stuff and I'm going to find it. I'm going to post it in the Facebook group. What's up, Joseph? Says second cruise and planning for October 2025. That's what's up. That's what's up. All right. So the Petersons Expedition... Said, can you purchase the deal or no deal game card with a countable gift card and do the shows book up fast? Shows definitely book up fast. Yeah, but how it works is you're going to load your carnival gift card onto your sign and sale card. So basically, whatever's guaranteed in the card is going to pull from the gift card first. And then whatever's left over, if you got money and you put cash on it, it's going to pull. So, in a nutshell, yes. <laughs> in a nutshell, yes. <laughs> What's up, Ivan? Said thank you for everything y'all show and go through. God bless you both. You thank are you. amazing. And July the twenty fifth is going to be mine and my wife's first cruise. Awesome. We will be on the celebration eight days for the ABC cruise. All right. That's awesome for y'all. First one doing the eight day. Yeah, y'all. Say more power to you. That's, that's that's that's. It took, it took us took like a, it took three, us a, four years to get to us, it. Yeah, it took us a while. We was we were stuck at the five. <laughs> then we did the six. And then our first seven day was when we went to um, Europe. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, <laughs> to say that out loud. Yeah, uh, Antoine, the question about the drink packets, the yeah, the water don't count towards. No, the physical. water doesn't count. Yeah, Mm-mm. only only alcohol only beverages. Alcoholic. So only alcohol beverages and the um, spiked teas in the uh, coffee shop. Yeah, spiked coffees, teas. Yeah. So anything else that doesn't have anything alcohol in it is alcohol, unlimited. Anything with alcohol in it counts towards the drink pack. Yes, everything else unlimited. What's up, Sharice? Uh, says, should I should I drink the tea and then go straight to bed? No, that's not I, fun. <laughs> since that's I not don't fun. drink very much. No. Nah, so you want to drink the tea and, and then go stand and then, up and, yeah, and go have yourself a good time. Hey, drink the tea <laughs> and then go to the club. Now, don't get out on that dance floor like Terry Crews with a whistle. I'm like, where's Latrell <laughs> on the dance floor? What's up, Joseph said, what's the new thing, Carnival, I guess, with marriage licenses? I have no idea. Yeah, it did a spell check on you. What's the new thing with Carnival with, with marriage license? Yeah, it did a... Yeah, retype that. But what's the new thing with marriage license? I mm-hmm. am, yeah. If you know something that I don't know, and I do this every day, y'all let me know. Yeah. Because <laughs> I haven't seen anything different 
and it could be them doubling down on some of the stuff that they've already, you know, that's already in place. Say, do, 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 do. you can't wait for your cruise. cruise so y'all make people want to cruise. <laughs> say, all right. What's up, Addie? Said question. Cruising with kids. Cousins is, with kids. Cousins with kids, yes. It's, it is. It, it, <laughs> Is it actually safe to send your little ones to the kids' club? I have a five-year-old. Yes. It, it, it is. is, but anytime yeah. your child is not in your care, things can happen. Um, I won't say that anything is 100% safe ever. Um, I do feel better with a five-year-old because a five-year-old can speak. Yeah. Same and same. can tell you when things are not right and you can... Mm -hmm you know, gauge from their mannerisms that something's not right. Right. Um, but kids camp, very, very much one of them things that people love. Kids love it. Yeah. They ain't going to know you and, no more. And they legit don't, they don't want to know you afterwards. Right. Like yeah. mom who? Yeah. <laughs> and we say or that. Cousin, or cousin who? <laughs> yeah. And we don't have kids, but we, we travel with kids. Yeah. Like our cousins and stuff have kids. And those kids don't know us until it's time to go to dinner. Oh, it's yeah. time to do an excursion off the ship. Otherwise, they don't want to fool with us. Nope. They want to be in the camp. Uh, what's going on, 44 Links? What's up, fam? What up? All right, let's see. Go to Jubilee in 15 days. That's what's up. That's, That's what's, what's up. That's what's up. 111, 101 days to value. That's saying like so far away. But mm -hmm. it's really not. Do you know, like, legit, we were sitting here talking like, we're in April. Yeah. Freaking April. Like, we were just on the New Year's Eve cruise, bringing in the new year, and it's April. Sequana said, Lynette and Stanley. What up? I'm, I'm sitting here with my popcorn waiting for the group 2025 trip info. <laughs> I'm hoping that it could come out tomorrow. Yeah, I hope As long yeah. as they fix... It's just the yeah. link is fine. It's some verbiage that they put in the link, and what y'all ain't gonna do is drive me crazy because they put in there that I can book your flights. I ain't booking nobody flight. <laughs> uh uh. It's easier for you to do it. It's Who? Easy. I'm talking easier for you. To, oh, you personally, yeah. <laughs> uh uh. Yeah, especially if something happens, is they they don't make it easy. I um I <clears throat> cancel the whole thing for our book flights. What's up, Adrian? Said question. Sailing on a Mardi Gras in Mardi Gras, Mardi Gras in two days. Awesome. My luggage tag still don't show my stateroom. Um, show as TBA. TBA. I'm worried. Should I be worried? Yes, in two days. Give them a call. Mm. You did you do a guarantee room? Because in two days you definitely should have it. Yeah. Um. So yeah, definitely give them a call. Did. Did your check-in go 100% smooth when you did it on um online? Just trying to figure out what could be the problem. And yeah, and when I and when you show up to the port, we always recommend bringing your receipt document. So just make sure you bring that your receipt, showing that you got it. But got what? That you, that you pay for it. Pay for what? The true, the cruise, <laughs> the trues, the trues. That's something that's something like your aunt. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's see. San Bernardino. Is that it? I'm not even gonna guess no more. So you're not <laughs> and it could yeah. be. Yeah, but just not it's not clicking. It definitely could. Let's... What's you ain't gotta look for it no more? What's up, Roxy? Uh, it's bothering me. I'm going on my first cruise in June with Carnival. Can you guys tell us how dining works? Is the buffet style for breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Yes. I'm asking because I recently had a kidney transplant. Oh, sorry to hear that. Well, happy healing to yeah, you. Yeah, indeed. And thank God that God wish you that, speedy recovery. That you were able to get a kidney transplant. Yes, God that's is a amazing. Yes. Yeah, but you can get like the buffet is is the buffet. But I will say on the ships, it is repetitive. Mm -hmm. Even if they have several stations, the food is repetitive. Um, but like I tell people on a cruise, you're not gonna go hungry, except no. for MSC. No. And then for <laughs> and then for breakfast, we always recommend doing sea day brunch on sea days. So um every chance you can get not to get no breakfast from the buffet, go to sea day brunch. Yeah. And, and I think she may be on a schedule. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. So just wanted to make sure she has some options. And that's me assuming. 
Yeah, I keep looking at my um, my cameras because this little girl keep coming into our <laughs> yard and she's triggering our cameras. I mean, she uh, with her mama. Her mama is walking back and forth. But the little girl keeps venturing into the yard. And I'm like, if you don't get your, your kid. All right. I see it's 410 of you guys are still in the house. If you are still enjoying and getting value on this live, make sure you smash that like button. All right, I see we have another super chat from Melissa. Thank you, Melissa. Let's see him get up here. Thank you so much for the $20 super chat. Said so thank you. You guys may have made cruising stress-free. And that's that's definitely one of our goals. And that's so glad goal. for confirming that for us. We definitely want your trip to be fun and, and stress-free. Because I first we want ours to be like that. <laughs> All right. What's up again, Nikki Boone 194? Thank you for the 499 super Appreciate chat. You. Said, hey, y'all, I'm going on an Eastern Caribbean cruise through Carnival. Have y'all been on it? If so, what's the worst and best part? I get bored easily. We've been on the Eastern Caribbean and we freaking love it. Yeah. Freaking love it. So there's not going to be any, like, if you get bored easily, because I say the same thing about myself. Just make sure that you're getting out and about. Usually yeah. the boredom comes because you're not doing anything. Yeah, you parked. Yeah, you're yeah. just kind of parked and not putting yourself in the in the <clears throat> moment. Right. Do even if it's something that you're not interested in, do it. Because it probably would end up being like the most hilarious, <clears throat> fun thing that you've ever done. Yeah. And then, like we always say, have a game plan before you even go on the ship. Mm -hmm. So it's like we have some things in mind. It's kind of like it's kind of repetitive for us. We got different things that we do. And then we leave a little bit of room for spontaneity. Like, OK, let's let's you know, we just see something we want to try. But we mm -hmm. go on with a game plan. And sometimes sometimes the game plan is not having mm -hmm. a game plan. Sometimes. We don't been there, too. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Say WDW guy. Is that what? Walt Disney World guy? Did I, did I guess correctly? Thank you for the five dollar super you. chat. Said hello. Is the single supplement always more than double the cost of a cruise for two people? Uh, would be seen that way on the site. It's essentially the same price as two occupants, reducing the taxes and fees for the additional passenger. So essentially. The same as a double occupant. Yep. He said, yes, ma'am. It's indeed is. That's crazy. <laughs> I'm on it today. I've been taking my um, iron pills. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's see. Say, so is the thermal spa worth it? Yeah. Oh. Mm, 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 mm. All right. Let's see where we at. Uh, I see prayers going up for you, fam, about the kidney transplant. Yeah. Thank you, fam. What's going on, Montrese? What's going on with y'all? All right. So we'll make sure. I, get... uh, I don't see. know where you at now. I'm not got... talking to y'all because. Hey, I got a book. I got he... I got a bookmark here. I'm trying to get All right. to the bookmark. Do, 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 Full gospel, any of the more radical um, branches of faith, you know what the war cry is. I said, I know they're not on this football field paying the war cry, <laughs> and everybody in the stands was going right along right with on it. On in there, <laughs> why is the bookmark? Because you got knocked out, so it's probably yeah, that. probably yeah, it unchecked it. So if if I miss your question, is um, please uh, please forgive me. I'm gonna pick up where I. Where I am right here, because I can't remember where I was because my bookmark disappeared. Mm -hmm. What's up? What's up? Uh, what's going on, April? What's up, Jeremy? Said first cruise in September on Liberty. 
If a port is canceled, are you reimbursed for excursions? If you do your excursions through the cruise line, they're automatically reimbursed. If you did it through an outside vendor, then you need to make sure that you know when their cancellation policy is. Because if you get canceled and you're within that window where it's non-refundable, then you just A out. And that's unfortunate. Usually when they change a port, if they can, they usually do let you know as soon as possible. And it's usually before 24 hours before you're supposed to land there. Well, sail there. And you usually have a chance to email or cancel it in your app or however it is that you booked it. But if you don't have that and you booked outside of the cruise line, it's nothing that they can do. Right. What's up, Christina? Said first cruise ever. June the third through the seventh on Accountable Radiant. Been binge watching your videos, getting ready. Hey. Say hashtag preacher Stanley. Listen, <laughs> you don't even know. <laughs> <sighs> What's going on, Jackie? Said, do you guys know why they're on any cruises going out of Norfolk this year? Let me give you a backstory of this. <laughs> <laughs> well, our port, because that's our home port, was supposed to go under um, renovation this year. Now, here's the thing that kind of tripped me out with this is, unbeknownst to me, and shout out to the fam bam that's on the ground in the 757 because they've yeah, been, they been rolling by and actually letting me know what's happening, sending me pictures and everything. They were supposed to do the renovation, but they weren't scheduled to start it until May. Right. And I'm sitting here like, so y'all y'all legit missed out on all this money when you are just going to start the renovations in May? So that's the reason that it's closed. But thankfully, the stars aligned. So making lemonade out of lemons, when the bridge was taken down in Baltimore, they were able to reposition those ships to our port in Norfolk. So that's the silver lining with that right now is that Norfolk is up and running right now. And I don't know what's going to happen yeah. with the because those ships are also getting ready to reposition. Well, at least carnivals is i'm not sure about royals yet i haven't really went that deep with it but carnivals is about to reposition and so that'll free the port up again but like what the hey mm -hmm. that's why but 2025 they about to they about to pop it out indeed what's going on clutch vacation what's up fam let's see what's up uh casper cruising for the first time on carnival next month uh, for my spouse's first and, anniversary. That's what. Uh, okay. And then I say first no. anniversary. Spouse and eyes. Oh, Edward. spouse and eyes. Yeah, my bad. That look like a one from over here. <laughs> <laughs> I said we've been binge watching your content. Love y'all. Appreciate, Appreciate that. Appreciate y that. Appreciate it. Let's see. Uh, next question coming in. Oops. Yeah. Coming in from Easy Two. I don't want to mess up your screen name, but notice you mentioned your group cruise. Yeah. Uh, just recently described to y'all while researching Virgin Voyages. I have been on many cruises. Hey. How can I get info? Um, but don't have a Facebook. Our website. Our website. So sign up for our um, notifications list. Yeah, and, and we'll send that out. And it's down in the description. So we have a link for our group trips. Mm -hmm. We have a link if you wanted to book individual trip with us all that's down in the description yes and listen y'all are not playing about europe 2025 no. yeah man the greek island glow on virgin voyages when i look at how many cabins i have booked i'm like what in the freaking world yeah hi in the world look all of us about to go across the so, pond yeah together together yep that's gonna be i can't Baby. wait that's gonna be that's gonna be so fun What's going up, H um, HBCU Band Talk? What's up, fam? All Say right. What's up, lamb. lamb? Love your channel. Thank you. Uh, we are just one week away from our first Virgin Voyage cruise. Awesome. It was your videos that inspired me to book it. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate that. You are so I welcome. Think, so I, welcome. I, I feel honored when people do that with um, Virgin because we took a chance on Virgin because it was I, such a controversial line when it first came out. And it seems like once we started going, the Addie and Terry's of the world started going, um, Rich and Jazz, Jazz started, started going, going. It was kind of like we solidified that. Yeah. Come we, on, we, let's we come. Here. We, we in here. here. And now once we get on board, it's so diverse now. At first it wasn't. And we in there having a good time. Like some of the things that were like. 
house house seller. <laughs> I was about to grab something and had to turn this camera off. Um, but some of the things that used to be issues, not issues, but music and all of that, they you they don't got that down. Yeah, they got down. it much better. Dang, Kelly, yep, 514 days to Greece. That's yeah. crazy to oh, say out wow. loud. Wow, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's crazy to say out loud. Wow. Wow. Yeah, I have people hit me up like daily, like, what's the hotel information? I'm like, baby, they don't, they don't let you do that stuff um, 365 days prior. Like, I'm pushing them to give me the information as soon as possible because I'm working with um, a tour touring company over there. Um, but there's like, it's, it's the hotels is too early for them to do anything. Hey, did we know? Did we know T Rock was was a trucker? I did. Oh, okay. I didn't know you. Oh. We Facebook friends. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know you was a trucker. Cause That's... that is family right there. Yes, indeed. All day. Yep. Look, let me let me let me let me tell you, cause you probably not filled in. Her and her wife were on vacation, acting like they had good sense, oh. but they were acting like they had good insurance. I know they got good insurance. <laughs> I know they have good life insurance and health insurance from them doing the skit that they were doing on vacation. They all underwater and shit <laughs> with the helmets on, zip lining. Lord have mercy. I said, mm -hmm. they paid them dang on premiums. They got good insurance. Oh, Lord. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Kelly, um, I'm flying to, to Europe two days prior. Yeah, two days. Because one, jet lag is a mother Mm-hmm. And it hit me like a ton of, it wasn't bad, but I'm sitting there like, why is everybody asleep? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm sitting there like, it's time to party. Everybody sleep. Yeah. All right. What's up? Uh, fam say, do you recommend Paradise Beach or Mr. Sancho's? Depends on the experience that you want. If you want an elevated experience, um, Paradise Beach. If you want the... Doom, yeah. doom, then Mr. Sancho's. Yeah. Uh, Paradise Beach has better <clears throat> food. And it's more turnt than um, Mr. Sancho's during the summer. Depends on who's there with you. Yeah, and who's there. Yeah. yeah. All right. What's up, fam? What's going on, Gregory? Said, is the Wi-Fi package mandatory? If you want to push yeah. www dot or get on anything other than your Carnival Hub app, Yes. Yeah. Well, other than that, it's not mandatory. It's, it's yeah. optional. It's optional. Mm -hmm. But in this world that we live in right now, most of us can't go without internet. Nope. Can't stay disconnected. Can't stay disconnected. So you got to be on the World Wide Web. What's up, fam? Say, question. Is breakfast served every day of the, your cruise on Carnival? Is the main dining room or only sea day brunch? Okay. There, it used to be an easy answer, and it used to be only sea day brunch. But I have noticed on cruises now, they awesome. will have like a very short window, almost every day, where you can go to the dining room and get breakfast, and it's usually like two hours. Yeah, but that was on our cruise, so this would be a good question for the rest. So of have y'all been noticing? Have that? you been noticing that? Because we only we noticed that on the last couple of cruises. It was like, mm -hmm. wait a minute. So where this come from? Like you doing? You got a mini sea day brunch on um, a nine sea day? Yeah, yeah. So yeah, if y'all have experience, that let us know. Definitely let us know. Yeah, because they didn't send me an email on that. All right, Josh got another question. What the pros and cons of the fly to the fun? All right. I used to rave about fly to fun. <laughs> and I have a video on the channel about fly to fun. And I might even private it because it's not as great as it used to be. It used to give you a little bit of a discount when it came to your flights for um, booking it through Carnival. So basically, they were trying to create this all-inclusive experience for you. The only thing that I will say, and I preach against this, that if you're going to chance your luck and fly in the day of your cruise, again, I'm preaching against that. Don't do that. Because anything can happen and all of your money is going to go. <laughs> so if you're going to do it anyway, because y'all, some people don't be listening, do it through Fly to Fun. If there's an issue with your flight, <laughs> And it's the flight's fault that you did not get to your ship on time. Carnival has a guarantee within you purchasing through them that they will attempt to get you to the ship. 
Now, if you don't have a passport, they can't get you to the ship. Right. <laughs> if you have a passport, they will definitely attempt to get you to that ship. Otherwise, book directly through your um through the um airline because you're not getting a discount. And one of the and the major con with that is it is very hard to get your ticket ticketed. Right. So <clears throat> even when people do it through me, I have to call and push them to ticket the freaking flight so yeah. that these people can check in and get, you know, and secure their seats. It, I don't like it at all. So that's one of the reasons I just want to get it off the off the channel. Yeah, it used to be clutch. It used to be clutch as heck. Now it's becoming a little bit because it's uh, a it's a byproduct, to be honest, to the cruise line. So they don't put a lot of time and love into it. All right. I see some of y'all. Uh, thank you, Marcus and Didi. Said we just got off a cruise on four one. The breakfast in the dining room every day. Yeah. Plus vacation stay. They had breakfast on nine sea days, but it wasn't as good. Okay. Um, let's see. Uh, so the menu is different on port days, and there's mm -hmm. express breakfast choice. Uh, said uh, they had express breakfast on the legend, and it was great. Um, we are in the dining room for breakfast every day. Thank y'all for that. Cause yeah. we was wondering, cause we was like, cause you know we've been Say talking. Won't say nothing. Yeah, we've been <laughs> saying, we, yeah, we've been saying go see their brunch, and but I do appreciate they doing express breakfast, cause. Yeah, I was good when we did it, but it is it was a, a slight difference. Oh, because yeah. it, it definitely it was, was shorter, a shorter menu too. Uh huh. King um, Tolliver, you going on the horizon in March? Awesome. Um, We're Valium, going in August. Yeah, Valium, you can order the shirts in the description. We have the link to the shirts in the description. All right, let's see back over here. Uh huh. Mountain Valley water is green. It's not Mountain Valley water because that's, that's, that's my that's that's my water of love choice. That water. If you look at our freaking um card statement, it's Whole Foods, Whole Foods, Whole Foods. Only thing I buy not from Whole Foods water. is Mountain, Mountain Valley, Valley water. Yeah, see. What's up, LA TV? What's up, Rika? What's going on? What's up? Is Shalina? that our Rika go up? Oops. Oh, I thought it was my goddaughter's mother, Rika. <laughs> Say what's going what's going on, Joshua? Say bro, sis. What up? <laughs> we uh we will be on the sunrise this month. Have you ever have you all experienced this ship? Several yeah. times. Yeah, several times. Yeah, we love every time we've been on it, we had a great the time was had. Yeah, so if you go on the channel, um and you just type, search our video sunrise, you will see all the ones you'll see that all we of did. them. Yes, Kim, we did the boat last year. The who? Boat. Oh, God. Yeah, we did Boat last year. <laughs> Matter of fact, it's a video out there on social media, and you can actually hear Lynette screaming. You can. It's on our Instagram page. <laughs> it's on Instagram. So Instagram, Life With Us TV. I was hollering for my life. Thank you, Tavon, for capturing that. Yeah. Appreciate you. Yeah. <laughs> Say, uh, Kelly said, well, I know uh, there aren't any um, booking any of my flights. I started nope. leaving um, March or April. Yeah. 12... 14 months. Yeah. What's up, Master and Frank? Say, I love y'all. I'm going to call your travel agency when 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 go to, to the, the med, med next, next year. All right, I got you. Say, so, I had a transplant. I didn't know that, Zaire. Did so I, I know that? Say, I would not eat off the I would not eat off the buffet. There are many free places without going to the buffet. Right. Good information. Thank you, sir. Yep. And that's from one transplant to another. Yep. Appreciate that, Appreciate fam. That. Appreciate that. What's up, Adrian? Say so, yes. My check-in went smoothly. I did. I did know. I I did not know to be specific a guaranteed room. I've paid it in full since January. Huh. Yeah. Call them. Yeah. And get to the bottom of it because you should have it by now. Because even with guarantee rooms, they usually assign them within the week so that you can print your luggage tags. Say uh, we have four C days. It's the brunch every C day or just one? Every All one. of them. All of them. They'll do it on every All last of one them. of them. Yep. And, and I we, look. And we be right there. I'll be right there because <laughs> I'm going to get my yogurt and berry parfait. Hey, look on the port day on the port days, we might wake up late and not be able to make a express breakfast, but we're gonna make cheat day brunch. We are, yes, and we are. 
I don't care how hungover we are. We right there hungover. I don't get hungover. You have. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Healing Era? <laughs> <laughs> Say, I'm going on a cruise in about a week. Are the decks always full of people? I'm a bit anxious of large crowds. No, they disperse. Like yeah. it, on on embarkation day. Yes, yes. Yeah. But perch, I'm I'm like that too. But get in a position where you're comfortable. You yeah. can even go in high. Is yeah. actually going to be your saving grace. So go up to the higher decks and be able to look down because that lower deck where the where everybody dances at is where it's going to be the most packed. But after that, once they're going to disperse. Trust me. Right. Everybody's going to find their flow, go where they need to go, and, and that's it. Yep. Yep, you're going to be fine. All right. What's up, Brent Fruit and Travel Adventures? Hey. Sailing on Icon next month. Is the specialty dining worth it on the ship? Did we only do one or did we do two? We did two. So we did the... We did, oh, yeah. We did hibachi. Yeah, we did hibachi. And it was okay. Yeah. It, yeah, we've had... We've had better. Yeah. Hibachi. And then we did, what's the name of the seafood oh, one on there? Oh, God darn. Damien, you still here? What's the name of the seafood one on Ciao. there? Yeah, it was the, it's the seafood. Yeah, we did those two. Um, I like the seafood one. The seafood one for us was good. Right. Like, we had um good. Some people said that they didn't like it, but I honestly think anytime you can get specialty done, it is going to be better. Of course, it has to be. Um, yeah. better than what they're going to serve on the regular. But on the Icon, I will say the food was good. Was good. Yeah, the food was good. Yeah. 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 And yeah. you're going to have plenty of variety. I will tell you this, get you a Euro. Mm -hmm. So go over there. What, what is it called, baby? The Aquadome Aqua Marketplace. Yeah, Aquadome Marketplace. Yep. Go over there and get you a Euro. Where they shave the meat off right there in front of you. Good you're welcome, eating. Healing Era. You're so welcome. And um, Addie said the crepe or crap was amazing. Yeah. And I was watching her eat it and I was like, just, just give me a corner. <laughs> but we, I mean, we ate so much on that cruise. I was just sick of eating at that point. Hey, Shanae. Let's say, so I got to sign off for a few minutes, but I beat. So you, yeah, you got, so hopefully you're back now. <laughs> yeah, that was an 806. Look, Shanae always watches us when she's yeah. supposed to be paying attention in church. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Shanae was on the icon with us too. Mm hmm. Good people, 757 in the building. All right. So I am cruising. Era said only special that I had on Icon was um, Tapanyaki. Uh, that they are quite a bit. They are quite, a quite a, of inclusion eateries is, that, yeah. that I missed, especially down at all. Right. I agree. Yeah, I agree with that too. Yeah, you definitely didn't need to do it on the Icon. I just, we just did it because we wanted to pick, because we're kind of new. Well, not kind of, we are new to the Royal brand. So we wanted to, one, because I need to know what I'm talking about, wanted to try some different eateries that's not on the ships that we already been on. Right. So, All right. What is MSC sailing? MSC, what they call it, massive sailing crap. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all need to stop. No, MSC, honestly, if MSC gets their skit together, oh, they're they going to take over. Yeah, they'd be great because the their price prices point and is what they everything. Their yeah. ships are beautiful. Yeah. And honestly, our cabin attendant, which you can't base it on there because he probably not going to be yours or nobody else's. He probably at home now. Our cabin attendant was one of the best yeah. that I've had ever. Excellent. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. Like, I don't know if this dude was transferred from, like, a yacht club or a, like, luxury um, fleet or something, but this guy's customer service was everything. Man, every night on cue, sir. That's what, I, I don't mean to cut y'all. Yes, you it, do. It's hooked. It's hooked. Hooked. Thank hooked. you, Sunday. You said hooked. we had, said we had prayer calls tonight. That's what I'm back. <laughs> I'm calling your pastor. Hello. I'm gonna tell him. Say one of your members is not paying attention to the Lord right now. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so uh, what's the best camera to use to record cruise cruise content for YouTube? DJI Pocket Two. Yeah, DJI Pocket yeah, DJI Two or po Pocket Three. Yeah, po yeah, or Pocket Three. Pocket Three is better than the two. Yeah, somebody yeah. bought them a Pocket Three. They didn't buy me one. I said, oh, that's right. I, I need to buy that real quick because I said I'm going to buy it for the next cruise. 
Thank you for reminding me because I did forget. It wasn't really so a reminder. It was I a got demand. You. I got you. I got you. I got you. Yeah, it wasn't a reminder. Calm down. Calm so down. Calm down. What's up, Q? Michael said, question. We we be on uh, Accountable twice, but my next cruise will be uh, our eight-year-old daughter on Accountable Horizon. Will it be things to do to keep her oh, entertained? Yeah. On the oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I feel like the kids sometimes have more fun than we do. Yeah. And they have... um. What do you call that thing with a theater that interacts on there? They have that on Horizon. So G said they keep on playing around with that war cry. Gonna have them lay down on that field. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You be uh -huh. oh, oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> be sitting there. <laughs> so that war cry take you out every time. Every time. Yep. Every time. All right. So you say I'm not going to shout today. I'm gonna act like I got some sense today. Next thing you know, you. <laughs> What's up, Clutch Vacations again? So what destination do you all want to visit you haven't been before? Alaska? The Southern Caribbean that we yeah. get ready to do. And I do want to do um, that African um, continental thing. I mean, Bob, is a lot of them. <laughs> I definitely want to migrate that way eventually because I do want to. I mean, as an African American, I definitely should. <laughs> and then I've been telling her I want to do a cruise to Australia, yes. but she she fight me on that one. And where is that that we have been planning all to go together? What what is it? Argentina? Is it Argentina? One of them. Yeah, it's one of them. Yeah, but outside of cruising, um, Maldives, Bor Bor. Yeah, Bor Bor is mine. Um, yeah, Bor Bor is the, Bor Bor and Maldives is like up there. And Barbados, we have not been to Barbados. I have that on my list too for 2025 as a group cruise. So yeah, if y'all want to go to St. Lucia and Barbados, tap in. Katie said, "Can we do?" Uh, Katie Pop said, "Can we do Alaska for 2026?" Huh. That's very feasible. Because hmm. yeah. I do want to do it, and I almost like I, I looked at Stanley and I said. We should have held off on going on melanin at sea when we did Thanksgiving, yeah, and we should have went to Alaska. And we yeah. should have went to Alaska. Yeah, because when can you go to Alaska with all your peeps yeah. at the same time? Probably F never. So yeah, we got to get to Alaska because we got to just check it off the bucket list. Yeah. Say uh, I wouldn't mind sailing to um, Cabo either. Because a lot of sailings have an overnight in Cabo. So I wouldn't mind doing that. All right. So uh, Jenna said, I will be going on my next cruise in 11 days on the Carnival Radiant. Love okay. watching you guys. We will be our fifth cruise. That's what's up. Awesome. But still coming to your first time cruises video. Hey, and we appreciate it. Hey, Jenna, hey, you, you ain't the only one. You, you, ain't, the only one. you ain't the only one. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, have we really been on here an hour and a half? Oh, we have. And we literally said we're gonna be on here an hour tonight because we're tired. I, but, I, but I said every most time you wouldn't go. You're welcome, Jackie. What's up, Nolan? Dad said evening. Y'all have y'all ever come across any other celebrities on a cruise? Not on. Well, hold on. Wait a minute. Let me see. Um, shoot. Yes. Um, what's the guy? Someone from YMCA? Anderson Cooper. Oh, yeah, Anderson, Anderson Cooper. Anderson Cooper was on um MSC with us. Yeah. We saw him. I didn't bother him. Um, Saw him in the game room yeah. with his son. I um, think that's it. I don't remember nobody No, else. like we, we usually see celebrities like in airports. Like yeah, 50 Cent was behind us. In Miami. Yeah, we started in Miami. <laughs> I turned yeah. around and looked over my shoulder and I said, oh my God, this 50. <laughs> <laughs> and real nice guy. Like he didn't look like he was not approachable. He looked very nice. I said, but we know you petty as hell in real uh -huh. life. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, very low key. Um, but I have ran into a lot of celebrities in life in general. Right. And I think it's just because I don't care. <laughs> yeah, because they, I mean, at the end of the day, they they are uh, they like to be treated like regular people. But I will tell y'all a funny story that I have to get the um, picture from my cousin because she has the picture. Um, Debo, Tommy Tenney, me, rest in peace, he, he's dead now. He put me in a headlock. Yeah, that happened. <laughs> like, who who can say that they he put them in a headlock? Me. 
Right. And how it happened was we were in a mall and this was back in his wrestling days. And I guess he was doing some kind of signing and whatnot. And a whole bunch of girls was like, y'all need to go in there right there. He over there signing stuff. And I, and I said out loud, I was like, I don't care. <laughs> and he heard me say it. So him hearing me say he didn't, that I didn't care about coming over there and get it. He came from behind the table where he was signing stuff at and was walking behind me. And was like, what you say? What you say? <laughs> And I said, oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> and I stopped it. He came out. He was like, go sleep. Go sleep. <laughs> yeah, so that's that was a funny encounter. And um, then we got the pictures of it. Yeah, thank you, EJ. I was getting ready to, um, to tell Katie, yeah, that's a European cruise line. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, We because we, 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 when you answered the question, you said the joke, but never said what MSC oh, really yeah, yeah, was. Yeah. yeah. Sorry about that, fam. Yeah. Sorry about that. Thank They're you, known for their, their contribution to the railways, but they... The kids started doing the cruises. Right, yeah, because they do like, uh, I didn't even know that until we was on it. They, they did those storage units and all that. Yeah, storage, yeah. Yeah. What's up, his queen dog question? This is a rant. This is random, but do you all um lock your suitcases with TSA approved locks prior to boarding the cruises? No. No. They're going to get into it anyway. They're going to get, yeah, they still can get in. Yeah, so yeah. I, I don't even do yeah, it. Yeah, I don't mess with it, yeah. Don't even do it for the airport either. I don't nope. even do it for because the they're gonna get into it anyway. Now I will say, when I'm in a resort, I will do it at resorts, uh, and I do it when we get to the resort, and I put a lot of my good stuff. She probably shouldn't say this in there because one, you're gonna know if they were in there. Yeah. So you're gonna know if somebody went in there and took your stuff. Right. But um, for a cruise, <clears throat> to be honest, I'm one of those people that I know what it takes for those people to get over there from their home country to leave their people to work on those cruise lines. I I I I, I really nine times out of ten, they're not gonna touch nothing. Right. They so value too much their, of a risk. Yeah, they value their work too much. So just think, so just think about if you go to your job tomorrow and you steal, you lose your income that you use to take care of yourself and your family. Right. And you got to ask it, is it worth it? Yeah. Yeah. But that's actually different if you're flying to a country. Yeah. Because they they going to leave that job and get another job tomorrow. <laughs> so I, I do treat it differently when I fly yeah. into destinations. What's up, Angel? Said my first first time catching the live. So glad you well, were catching welcome. live for the first time. So I've been watching y'all since last year. Took my first cruise last month on Allure okay. and loved it. We liked Allure, yes, too. Yes, we did. Booked another one for next year in April. That's what's up. That's what's up. Yes, indeed. You can't wait to grease EJ. I can't Yeah, I either. can't wait. I can't wait. This is going to be this is gonna be the trip. Loved our Virgin videos. Listen, Virgin was a whole vibe. Yes, it was. It was the trip that I didn't know I needed. Because I did not want to go. Right. <laughs> and I'm so glad I went. And I had to make you go. He did make me go. Because I, he literally was like, baby, how many times in life does a cruise company personally invite you Stop it, Katie to come on board? <laughs> Stop it. And I was like, <laughs> and it was like, they didn't invite you to come to Miami. They didn't invite you to do this. Your work has afforded you to be invited to Greece. Oh, we're going. Yeah. And I was like, I don't want to go to Greece. Yep. <laughs> and yep. I said, I, I said, I don't care what it costs. We got to go. Said question. Oops, I hit it. What's up, Annie? Said question. Um, dining for a group on a ship 20 plus. Is it worth to try to go to the main dining room to dine? Yeah. If you have a, an yeah. official group, yeah, the group's department will set that up for you. Yeah, don't even stress yourself about that. Yeah, make that as easy as possible. Mm -hmm. But even if you're not with the group, call and link everybody together, and you're going to have to um do set time dining. That's that's the catch to that, is that they're going to have to set you up with set time dining. All right, what's up, Kim? Say, hey, family, do y'all feel like the icon was overpriced? No. No, it is, it is, it is price. It's price for what you're going to get and right. experience on mm -hmm. board. Is it expensive? Yes. <laughs> yes. It is very expensive. Right. But once you get on board, and I think everybody can attest to it, <clears throat> you see exactly where your money was spent. And you're, it's the ultimate 
vacation. It's yeah. literally the ultimate family vacation. It is. But if you're a person that does multiple vacations a year, you may want to want to you may want to like like get yeah. another alternative. Yeah, use that as for like that Your year one-offs. that you yeah, that you trying to go all out this year. Yeah, so we, and we're going to do the icon. Yeah. So that's why we we did a, a live a few months back um talking about how you can kind of put yourself ahead of these things cuz the thing about vacations, I feel like no vacation is is going to be cheap. Uh, you're going to pay for a vacation. That's true. Yeah, you're going to pay for it. So that's why we taught people a vacation savings is your setup. So that way you can have money going in that account even when you're not going on a cruise. So when something comes like the Icon or or the Star of the Seas or um, what's, um, what's Carnival's new ship that's coming? What? <laughs> a, I, I thought they had, no, Jubilee. That's all we out. Yeah. They they ordering new ships. They got them. They, so got, got, them on, they, got, they got them on order. They got them on layaway, <laughs> y'all. So that way you don't have to get ready for your trip. You will already be ready. Come on, for the now. vacation savings. Yeah, it'll change your life. It vacation will. savings change your life. That, and that's how we take every trip that you see that we able to take that we have to spend money for comes from our vacation savings. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So when the opportunity comes, swipe. Still hurts. Swipe. Yeah. <laughs> All right. What's up? Lisa Love Beauty said, question for the Greece trip. How you apply for a visa or can I use a passport? Very good question. So you definitely use your passport to fly into Greece. But Greece, um, Europe in particular, is starting this new program in 2025 where you have to get, um, I don't know how you pronounce it, but it, I say Itaras card, E-T-I-A-S card. And basically, it's a way of taxing you while you're all over there. It's They call it a visa, but it's not really a visa. It's really just, it's going to attach to your passport. So basically, you go online. It's not even live yet. You go online. You tell them where you're going, how many days you're going to be there. And that information attaches to your passport. You get a link to pay for how many days you're going to be there. And all is well with the world. It's supposed to be a very seamless process. But it's, it's really no different than like if you go to Punta Cana or you go to Mexico where you have to pay a Mexican tax at the um, airport. Really no different. It's just called a different thing for Europe. They're going to start getting a little bit more money out of us for going. But if you're not staying an extended amount of time, you don't need a true visa. All right. We see Solid Sister said, blessings to all. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Back to you. Indeed. I've never been on a cruise, but been um, watching videos. Hey. YouTube makes me, YouTube makes me overcome my fears. Oh, I appreciate oh, that. Oh, excellent, excellent, excellent. We've heard that a time or two. So going on a Valor out of New Orleans for five days. Are there things to do early in the morning? And New, you're in New Orleans. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go get you some food. Vibe out. Because trust me, New Orleans don't sleep. <laughs> yeah, you'll be fine. Say, I bet I will try to do the same. Yeah, come yeah. on. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm going to be at the hotel two days before. Yeah, that's a must. Yeah. What's up, Official Adventures again? Been on Carnival and Royal, and their cakes are horrible to me <laughs> <laughs> with the whipped icing. <laughs> so how is the icing on the cakes on version? I will say I'm not a desserts person. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't. Not on vacation. On land, I am, but on vacation, because that's when I use my time to drink. I don't really drink. drink yeah, drink and eat a lot of sweets. Um, yeah, at home. So if I'm drinking on vacation, I don't. I can't eat sweets. I can't. The two. Mm-mm. But I'm trying to remember because I know we've had dessert on there before. But my cousin loves. What is it that, that she? Oh yeah, that s'mores. Uh, s- s'mores in a jar. Yeah, yeah. She tore them up. Yeah, she said it was the best thing ever. So if you go on Virgin, get a s'mores in a cup. But I heard that their desserts are great. I just have not. Yeah, but but I'm I'm with you though. Them them cruise cakes. I don't I don't fool around like. Yeah, yeah. The they melted just, cake used to be everything, but it's horrible yeah. now. It's like they barely cook it. And then um, a lot of people say that it's a, like a confetti cake that they use, that they have like on um, embarkation day. But like I said, I don't I don't eat sweets on vacation. Yeah. And if I and if we do, most of the time it'll be ice cream. It'll be ice cream. Mm-hmm. 
What's up, Janetta? Say hey, Queen Lynette and hey, King what up? Stanley. My wife and I are planning a uh, cruise on Virgin for our 40th birthday. That's what's up. Which ship would you would give me the better bang for my buck? It's not even the ship. It's right. it's the itinerary. itinerary. Yeah. Because the ships are exactly the same. Yeah. I mean, they have their personalized touches, but it's the itinerary that's going to um, change it for you. The cheapest itinerary on Virgin is going to be the Fire and Sunset Soirees, which is Key West. Mm -hmm. I don't. This is my personal opinion, y'all. Yeah. So don't shoot the messenger. I don't <laughs> understand why people take that cruise. <laughs> I don't understand it. Yeah. Um, but if you're a person that really are just going because you want to enjoy the ship, yeah, that's I perfect. Get it. It's perfect. Yeah. But, but for our itinerary, I, uh, I, I don't know. I, I, guess I, feel like, I, feel like, I feel like I went home to my hometown. That's what it felt yeah. like. Yeah. Because Key West there. is legit the same vibe as Stanley's hometown. We mm -hmm. legit felt like we were there. Um, but uh, we done. We've done Dominican days. I love um, Dominican, yeah, Dominican days. days was oh, great. I love Dominican days. Uh, we get ready to do Riviera Maya. Yep. in um July. Yeah, so we'll be able to come back and tell you that one. But Dominican days is actually a really good one. And then if you want to go, you know, out a little bit further Mediterranean, we did Brazilian Lady. Yeah, we did the Greece itinerary. So that's then you can go out of San Juan. Now yeah. they're more expensive. The San yeah. Juan ones are expensive. Yeah, so hopefully that helps. Now, yeah, the, the fire and um, sunset sprays, I sell a buttload of them, and I'm like, pay a little bit more, go somewhere else, because <laughs> it's nothing to, in my opinion, it's nothing to do. Didi, Didi and uh, Marcus said they take the version cruise because it's just the cheapest. <laughs> <laughs> but the one thing I love about Virgin is if people can, like people that are used to carnivals, Royal Caribbeans and whatnot, when they go to Virgin and they see the sticker. They're like, oh my God, why is it so expensive? It's because once you pay that sticker, you that's it. That's it usually. Yeah. I mean, up until recently, they even used to throw in the bar tab. Yeah. Now they throw the, it in sometimes. No, they, no, it's I over mean, now. Oh, the, it's over. They, it's over. Oh, it's completely over now. Okay. Thank <laughs> I you. Said, no confusion. <laughs> okay. Okay. I, I didn't know it was completely over. Oh, yeah. it's over. Okay. Trust me. <laughs> so yeah, the only thing that you would have to really buy at this point is your bar tab, if that's your thing. Because the internet is included, mm -hmm. gratuities, um, gratuities included. are included. Your yeah. basic beverages are included, which means water, sodas, juice, all of that's included. Yeah, but if you and the thing about it, we like it, if you want, they don't have the drink package. They have the bar tan, like we said, and you don't have every person in the room don't have to buy it. Yeah. So that's that's the blessing. So too. you can get one tab and both of you, and you can share with whoever, whoever you want. So if you see somebody and you want to buy them some and buy them shots, it, they don't care. Yeah, I be doing it. We do. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Any recommendations for using cruise cash? Like what to buy? If you cruise it with me, you can buy me some. <laughs> but anything, I mean, yeah, anything. you can buy anything, yeah. But be um, be careful with it because you have to you have to use it. Yeah, so if you buy it, you have to use it. Or you lose it. it. Or you lose it, yeah. So yeah, I mean, you want to buy some merch? You can buy merch. Yep. Let's see. Are we? Oh no, we not. We got all that. We got to. My What's up, fam? Here. Say love you guys. I am on my first cruise. You guys have been so helpful. That's, that. that's what's up. Appreciate that. What's up, T uh, Tana? Say I'm cruising on the Mardi Gras at the end of November. Are there any holiday activities? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, they, they go out for the holidays. So, yep. Um, Our shirt. Um, I already link. answered that. Okay. Yeah. All calm, right. Calm your mm -hmm. ass down. Make sure. <laughs> <laughs> Say what you want. What's up, Silas? I said, do y'all help with first-time cruisers, book cruises? Yes, we That's do. That's my specialty. So we do it for Carnival, Virgin, and Royal Caribbean at this time. At this time. All right. Get ready to add celebrity to the mix. All right. Let's see. All right, uh, BC Clock 922. So, question What's your favorite carnival ship? Celebration, celebration without hesitation. 
What's up again, Joe? So Lynette and Stanley, thanks for all the great info. The wife and I are on the Freedom, <laughs> May the 6th, and I don't even drink, and I think I might get a Tokyo tea. So Joe, <laughs> Joe. Yeah, so since, Joe, you, hey, so since you don't drink, no. Joe, just, hey, look, get one. Just get one. Split it between yeah. you and the wife. She said it. So, yeah, so, yeah, you said that. But, yeah, <laughs> take your time. If you eat a drink, take your time. Take your time. Yeah, take your time. Eat carbs that day. Eat plenty of carbs. So if you be eat beef, get your burger. <laughs> Go get your slice of pizza because you're gonna have to coat your stomach because you're gonna need something that's gonna start to soak it up. Yeah. What's up? What's up? Um, half outdoors going on a pride this coming week. Not my choice. <laughs> <laughs> Any helpful info? <laughs> you already know. Yeah. You already know. Like <laughs> lean in. Yeah. You're going to have an amazing time. We're going to speak it into existence. You're going to have a great time. Yeah. What's up? What's up, uh, Chantia? We are looking to um to a Hawaii cruise in awesome. either 2025 yeah, or 2026 yes. for our 25th wedding anniversary. Which Porsche will be good to travel from? Um, we live in, in Albuquerque. Yeah. Um, so you're trying to do Hawaii? Most of the time you have to fly to Hawaii. To do um that um that roundabout to the different islands um if I'm not mistaken yeah yeah you have to fly in um G you going on a freedom and glory in August that's side by side are you that's what's up so you should change that and you should come over and jump over and go on a horizon with us yeah and say so have you been on both or either and what are the pros and cons. We were been we've been on the glory. Yeah, the, the glory was the was it, but it won't just it won't it wasn't the, the ship. It, it was, was us. us. Yeah, that was uh uh that was the bomb cruise. Yeah, like not in a good way, bomb. But it, I mean, maybe we need to give it another no, because I'm not going all the way out there to get on the glory. I was gonna say maybe we should give it another shot now that we know what we're doing. Because it, it wasn't nothing wrong with the ship at all. I haven't been on the freedom. Mm -mm. Right. But yeah, glory. Glory was glory. What's up, Douglas? It's Stanley answered my questions. Is a cruise, is cash limits you can bring on your cruise? Now, nah, there isn't a limit. Yeah, but, but don't, 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 don't be, don't do too much. Right. Yeah, that's just for your safety. Yeah, so we, we just normally bring enough to be able to tip the porter on day one have some emergency yeah, funds if we have some emergency to. funds we need it and then also have enough cash tips to hook those people up that that treat yeah. us really well that go above and beyond yeah um the call of duty i'm gonna say can you take a vape pen in your carry-on no yes you can i mean you can but as long as it don't have like thc or um I'm, you know i'm thinking i'm thinking we vape. Know. i'm thinking we vape but <laughs> yeah yeah, yes, yeah, yeah. Uh, That's why yeah, I tobacco, said what I said. Tobacco vape, yeah. So yeah. no CBD, <laughs> yeah. No THC. Has it gotten on? Absolutely. Will I tell you to bring it on? No. Yeah, but back to um uh um Douglas. So normally, most time we take about three about three or four hundred dollars now. Yeah. With us, and most of the time we bring in most bring of that. Back. that. Mm -hmm. We used to bring a whole lot more. We used to like, do five or six hundred, but yeah, we don't, we don't, we yeah. don't do that no more. Star Child said my cruise is paid for. However, my roommate changed his mind, but the room is already paid for. Do I let Carnival know he is not going? Um, well, I got my cruise cash for myself. They offered a hundred dollars per person. So it it depends. It depends on what promotion that you booked under. Because if you were to take them off of the sailing, most of the time they would charge a administrative fee to take them off. But if they, sh if you show up to the port and they are considered a no show, they can also put a penalty on that. So it call and get your options based on what the situation is, because it can be handled such a different way. P Marcel, it is not too late to join the 2025 group trip to Greece. No. Yeah, you so you still can book. Um, I can't. Um, we sent out an email uh, about a week ago that we are 
getting down into the wire because we only doing um was 100 cabins and we at 70 something now yeah no 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 yes, no we're not that high 60 nah. some it's high i can't yeah no i don't know if someone's that it was in the email yeah because yeah, i, I email. didn't count it count it before we got on here but because i was look i'm looking at my travel joy but right if now. you want but if you want to go we we anticipating probably the next couple of months or so that it's probably going to be gone What's up, Taz? Again, does room service cost? Like, can I do my breakfast in bed? It's really not even breakfast, to be honest. Right. Not on, not on carnival. Not on carnival. Yeah, it's, you're gonna want to get up. You're gonna you need wanna to get, get up. up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> now, Royal Caribbean is different. Yeah. Royal Caribbean has a real breakfast, and you can definitely do that in bed. Yeah. You order it the night prior. It comes. Yeah. You pay the delivery fee. Mm hmm. Um. um you can also do that with um Virgin. Virgin Very good. too, yeah. And then the, the Virgin charge you a delivery fee if you don't spend a certain amount. I can't remember that I think amount. It's six dollars, six ninety nine. Yeah. But if you yeah. buy a beverage, any kind of beverage, yeah, that costs money, then they don't charge take you. It off, right. Yeah, they don't charge you the delivery fee. Basically, spend something. Kwani said, "A zoomy." A zoomy. Yes. Say, I know your screen name, Quanny. <laughs> <laughs> so you're making me hungry. <laughs> Look, we haven't even eaten tonight, and it's going to be really bad to eat this late at night, but I got to do what I got to do. What's up, Christy? Okay, question besides the Italian pasta bar, what other specialty restaurants provide lunch with no extra costs? Um, Mongolian Walk. Mm-hmm. Mongolian walk is good. Yeah. Um, but sometimes it be so hard to get over there. Be, that stay packed. Yeah. If you are on the ships that have like the barbecue, definitely can get that for oh, free. Oh, yeah. Um, um, as a specialty restaurant. It's another one. I can't think of it right now. What, are you talking about steakhouse? No. Oh, oh, they ain't give you nothing for free. No. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, definitely... Um, Kachina do does it for free during the day. Yeah, Mongolian Wall. It's it's a no. What's up again, Christina? Say if if booked on a Greece trip, do you help make sure we land in the right airport on the right day? Um, with the time changes, don't want to miss the ship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Most definitely. Yep, yeah. land in Athens, Greece. A A T H Airport. What's up, Step? Say, hey, y'all, thanks for the information. Question, please. Do I need to put a credit card on file in order to pay for, excuse me, additional charges while on or off the ship? Well, that's only a applicable on the ship. You don't have to put one on file. You can guarantee it with cash or nothing. Like, you, you're not made to put anything on there. But trust me, I ain't trying to be funny. Even the most strict people spend something on a cruise and you don't want to get to a point where you want to spend something and don't have the means to do it and have to go and fund your card because right. they're not going to take your cash and they're not going to take your regular credit card to swipe it. So, yeah. All right. Let's see. All right. Star said, can I put another person in his place? Yeah, definitely. Michael like said, I said, it could be a fee too, depending on the promo. Michael said, "Hey, y'all ever do the pineapple thing? Yeah, yeah. you got the hands up there. <laughs> yeah, y'all didn't know we were swingers. <laughs> don't do that. No, please, <laughs> please don't do that. Don't do that. You know what happened last time? <laughs> please, you walk on star. Don't do that." <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna tell y'all something. We're gonna let y'all go right. We probably shouldn't tell y'all this, but we're gonna tell y'all because once it was upon years a time, ago, it was years ago. Once upon a time, we joked about that. Where we were like, they were like, How do y'all make y'all marriage work the way that y'all wanted to work? And we were like, first of all, we're best friends. Um, so outside of being a married couple, we really are best friends. And then we were like, plus, when we get sick and tired of each other, we're swingers anyway, so we just switch up. <laughs> here's the thing i was expecting people to really know that our personality allows us to joke like that we started getting propositions in our email <laughs> and yeah. i mean and this was these were 
these were people with pictures. We were told that we they wanted us to be in a closed quad. We had a stipend that we were to be in this closed quad that we would get paid every month. <laughs> <laughs> and it's the bad thing about it is these are actually real people that I were able to look up and they are in my city. Yeah. So it's not even like it was like a ha ha day in California. Like they saw, no, no, no. Within a 30 minute radius. <laughs> That's why I said, no, take that back. Don't, said, no, no, no. don't you joke about that no more. Nope. Nope. Say, like, don't even, don't even throw that out. Even some joke, don't even throw that out here. <laughs> I, said, dear, dear. I said, they wanted us to bend it over, bust it open. Oh. No, no, no. Lord. So Lavina said, can you take candy on the ship? The, the cruise what line say no. But, what kind of candy? Uh, yeah, she's uh, Lavina. So you know what kind of candy I'm talking about. No, uh, <laughs> you, you have to do it at your own risk. Do but, it at your own risk. But the the crew, <laughs> the cruise line say no. <laughs> but but you can say yes at your own yeah. at your own risk. But to answer your pineapple question, heck no. But we, I'm a people watcher. Like I want to go to Temptation Resort to watch. Like I am that person that is like. I see you. I see what you do. It have fun with that. Like I'm that kind of person. I, I have fun with people that are in the lifestyle, but nah, we're not. Oh, Lavina said no regular candy, y'all. Oh, okay. Yeah, prepackaged. Prepackaged. Yeah, pre yes. yes. Yeah, we got. Yeah, we, gotta, yeah, we have. To, we have to specify sometime because yeah, yeah, the fam come through and they ask about candy, and you know that's the first thing we think about. It shows a lot about the people that we are. Yeah. <laughs> because our mind immediately goes there. All right, let's see. I just seen, <laughs> just seen uh y'all laughing at the closed quad. Yeah. I was like, oh my lord. Where are we go? Here we go. Oops, did I miss some super chats? Um, yep. So I got caught up. Sorry, y'all. Let me go on going back in the suit. Thank you, Jeanette. I don't know if we said it. Thank you or not. What's up? What's up again? t hey. Thank you for the five dollars. She was at hey, what's up, fam? Next cruise, not until May of 2025. Okay. On a celebration, South Caribbean so, trying to hop on it with y'all in 2025. Hopefully. Love come on. Come on. Come Love to have you, fam. Yes, indeed. Come Look, we're trying to get y'all to come across the pond with us. Yeah, man. What's up, Josh? Thank you for the five dollars super chat. Say you. about to go on a sunrise at the end of April. Is this one that you liked? Yeah. Yes, yes. I it had is. my birthday on the sunrise. I told you I acted a fool. You hear me? Look, let me tell y'all something. Um, if you going on the sunrise and you like water slides, get on the water slides. Man. One of the best. Yeah, get on the water slides, and then the second one, if you getting sunshine. on the sunshine. Definitely get on them water slides if you if you like water slides. I'm telling you, man, change life. Mm -mm. I love water slides. I, I like the one better, the one they drop you, you go in the enclosure and they drop you. Yeah, that's that's wow. crazy. That's insane. What's up, Victor? Thank you so much for the 499 super chat. Say, do you all know which website is the is the best place to book excursions for Cancun resorts and the prices for flights um uh for August? Or should I wait? August, you're gonna pay regardless. Yeah, it's prime um prime month, prime season, June all the way until like mm, September ish. You're gonna pay. Um, Viator is a good resort for a day, day pass. I don't know. Well, hold on. I don't know if day pass works in Cancun, but resort for a day definitely does to um so you can get your resort passes. Indeed. What's up, Chef Sonia? Thank you so much for coming a member of the channel. Welcome. We greatly, greatly appreciate Sir that. Sir John Go. What's up, hey. fam? Thank you for the 490 designs. That question, what is the liquor policy for bringing liquor back home? Yeah, I don't really care. Yeah, you can bring it back. Yeah, so when you come back care. and report, they're going to take it from you, then you pick it up on the, um, yeah. the, the on um, debarkation day. Yep. The only thing that is, <clears> if you're flying home, then you got to make sure that you have a means to pack it in luggage because you're not going to be able to carry that on right say the dominican republic excursion scams or no what you mean i mean to be honest with you 
in every country, there is a potential that you're going to run into somebody that's not going to be right. So make sure that you're booking through those reputable websites that um, guarantees. And I mean, they're out there. Viators of the world um, is another one we use when we're in Dominican Republic. I can't remember the one where they took us up the mountain. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah, long as you're using really good websites. Um, and also, if you get to a resort and you stand at a resort, usually they have an excursions desk there where they have people that they vetted out and that you can use to them. So yeah, it's, it's smart ways to not get scammed. <laughs> yeah. Say so what size luggage are allowed to bring? Cruise lines really don't the care. Size. They have, Thank you, course, Kim, for answering the, answering the question. Yeah, too. I guess they really don't care. They have it yeah. listed, <laughs> but they don't care. Right. We just say that if it, you know it's oversized, we, tip we, them porters. Yeah, we tip the porters. Yeah. Tip them good. I mean, tip them anyway, but tip them good. And we know I'll be overweight, so we tip them really good. <laughs> Let's say your bag was pulled on Icon going through security for all the candy. <laughs> <laughs> and the guy was like, you're a sugar head? <laughs> Should I? <laughs> Rum runners, what's your take on it? I used to do it until I became a travel agent. And then I was like, what I'm not going to do is risk my income bucking around with no rum runners. with a rum runner. Um, but if you can do it right, but if you can do it right, it I, works. Yeah, we do. We, we at the times that we have done it before she became a travel agent. Yeah, oh, it, worked. Uh, it came through every time. They ain't take nothing. Not not nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I ain't really <laughs> to risk it. You ain't gonna snatch my hunger, my credentials. <laughs> so Jerome said, "Can we check our carry on if we want to?" Yes. Yeah. Yeah, you can. Yeah. Just make sure your carry-on stuff that you need is Ain't not in, there. in it. Right. Yeah. But we're going to get off of here because one, can't feel my butt cheeks. <laughs> Two, can't feel the, my butt cheeks. And three, I'm hungry. <laughs> All right. Hope that you guys got much value out to out tonight's live. We answered as many questions as we could. You know, I saw this one. What did you say? Uh Best cruises for high school graduates. <laughs> now, if they like to turn up, Virgin. Yeah, or I was, Carnival. I was, yeah, yeah, in between like Virgin or or, or, or Carnival, yeah. yeah. More, more close to. Uh, yeah, it's it's a hard toss up though. I would put them on Virgin. I mean Carnival before I put them on Virgin. You would. Uh huh. So what are rum runners? Rum runners are plastic containers. That should be non-detectable right. to and you, scanners and stuff. And you can pour your look at it. So they come in all different sizes. Mm -hmm. Liter, 3.75, the 750 mm -hmm. um, milliliters. And you just pour your look in there. So people like, you know, they used to be us. Bring your stuff on one so that you can save a little bit of coin. Yeah. <laughs> Well, all right, fam. It has been great tonight, man. You guys have a fabulous Friday tomorrow. Don't work Absolutely. too don't work too hard on your job. Make sure y'all have a great weekend. Somebody and said, "Where the hooch is at on the celebration?" <laughs> er, well, er, well, <sighs> and make sure you stay up and come to the club. <laughs> yeah. So don't forget at the beginning of the live, we was like, if you if you want a t shirt like these ones, it's in the description. <laughs> Also, make sure you join our Carnival uh, Facebook group. Join the Virgin Voyages Facebook group. Also, if you're looking for things you need for your crew, Cruise Essentials, make sure you check that out in the description. And we go catch y'all in the next video. Straight from the VA. The dirty, dirty sound. Chew up. Chew down. Chew down. Chew down. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Oops, did it. Nope. Nope. We still here, y'all. We still here. <laughs>